stretch your train. Mom, I'm <coughs> not trying. I'm very good. Don't worry. Very simple, perfect. Mm -mm. Mommy, that's not fair. I'm telling you. You should learn to give me my flowers now that I'm still with you. Because <laughs> when I get married, you'll miss me. I like the fried rice more than the jello fries. <laughs> so tell me, which recipe did you use? Mm, actually, I... Mom, stop flattering her. I'm not enjoying the food. Mom, who is talking? <laughs> <laughs> Mom, I didn't use your recipe. I used mine. May I know? I won't tell you. Okay. It's a secret. Mm -hmm. And you should learn to give me my flowers now that I'm still here with you before I get married. <laughs> Don't worry, next time. Do you like the food? I know you. I know beans is your favorite. Don't worry, tomorrow I will make beans, fresh tomatoes and fried potatoes. <laughs> oh. Manage my food, manage. You know, you know your father, you know him with beans. No, you're not trying. He likes beans. Daddy, you're not eating again. Are you okay? <laughs> manage it. <laughs> Dad. 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 Daddy. 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 The doctor said we should wait for him here. And where is mom? Mom is with him. So why doesn't the doctor want us in? Dio, be calm down. I think the doctor knows what he's doing. Dio, be. You're the son of my right hand. There are things I must tell you before I join my ancestors. Father, you scare me when you speak in this manner. You promised you will never leave in sickness. You said you would join your ancestors in good health. That was what you said to me, Father. I will not die. But you must be there and strong to hold me when I fall. The family business and the people needed to be strong and astute, just like your father. Father, you are strong. You are resilient. You are brave. You are full of wisdom. All my life I walk Every day it was being like you. My son, you will not be like me. You will be your own king. You will reign in this great empire which I have built all my life. But watch out for the insider. His heart is evil. Father, the more I pay attention, the more confused I, 
I get. What do you mean by holding you when you fall? And then, who is the insider? You see, this is not the time to endash and induce endashable talks. This is not the time to induce endashable talks. I, I don't <laughs> understand. Why, why the drama? My father is not dead. Did anybody tell you he was dead? Where, where is he? He's in his room with his wife and the doctor. I need to see my brother at once. I need to see my brother. No, oh. you can't see him. The doctor said we all should be patient here. Shouldn't come inside, so just do the same. Huh? If his wife, your mother, is in there, why wouldn't I be allowed his own brother to, to go there as well? Well, the children can't see him as well, so you just have to do the same. I should have patience. I don't like the way all of you are just sitting here saying nothing when your father has been locked in his room for more than five hours now and nobody's saying nothing about it. Eh? And nobody knows what is happening there either. What's happening here? Well, Uncle, you just you just have to take a cheap pill and try not to be up on the hill. The doctor is in there with my father and my mother, so. In there with the doctor? And the doctor refused us, you know, to see him for what? If your father is dead, let that doctor just come out point blank and say, Jamal, say my brother is dead. Uncle, then what will... Can you just stop? Why are you talking like this? I am angry. I hate nonsense. So because you're angry, you're overreacting. Why are you sounding negative? I don't, exactly. I don't get it. I'm overreacting. Yes. I am overreacting over my brother's life. So you want me to just keep here and stand like a scarecrow where my brother is over there and we don't know anything what is happening there and I don't even trust that idiot, that quasi doctor. Uncle, please stop overreacting now. What's all this? Stop overreacting. Eko cool. And you, you have been sitting here like a marionette doing nothing and saying nothing. Look, like, like I said before, you just need to take a chill pill, try not to be up on the hill. We are also worried. Mm. Yes. Let me wait a second. Yes. I will go to the hill very soon. Let me stay a second. More. Then you will see me cry to the highest mountain. I am thinking, please. What, 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 what,
is a miracle. No, no, I'm not. He does not need any sorrow. What do you mean by his heart is critical? Am I the one that is going to kill my brother? Wait, 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 wait. There is nothing there. Please, madam. Chief does not need any disturbance. His health is critical now, please. Excuse me? Am I the one that is going to kill my own brother? You are stopping everyone from, 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 from seeing him and his wife is cooling off there. Stop, stop, stop. What? I should wait? Uh, doctor, please let him in. The lion himself. The giant of Africa. No, 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 hang up, please. Wait, don't touch him. Only speak, please. Uh, Javazi, you have to talk to this domestic staff of yours to be scrupulous the way we, the, he talks uh, with the Eze Wesley. He is not a domestic staff. I'm sorry, he's a medical doctor. His name is Dr. Cletus, our family doctor. May I ask that you stay out of this place? With, with please. You see, Chief, that's why I said earlier on, there should be no need for a third party here. Excuse me? Now, there was something I was going to tell you, but now I have to have to hang on until we're alone and in the private. Uh, if that is what the doctor wants, no problem. What do you mean if, 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 if by saying if that is what the doctor wants? This man has succeeded in relegating me to a potential personal non grata and you are aiding him. Me, you call Kunan a third party. Hey! A third party, me, in my own house? No, something is mine somewhere. Huh? You know what? I think you have ostrich mentality. There you go again! You are nothing but a dead scholar species! You are a dead scholar species! And nothing but an escalator! That's who you are! His health is critical. No, that don't tell me his health is critical! You are the one that is critically studied here before my brother and created chaos! He's a public he is user! He is This man is it a is public user! user. Uncle is always over here. Look at the way he's shouting. I knew this is what he would do the moment he gets in there. What I don't understand is why he will always raise his voice. Always shouting. Don't worry. Let me end this. Uh, Toby, don't. Toby, this is not fair. I Stop. know, but what do you want us to do? Beat him. Now, Mr. Man, what exactly are you upset about? You are reducing me twice the size of an ant in my own family by calling me a third party before the very eye of my other brother and his wife, and instead of them to do something about it, they are just watching you like, like, like they are watching a movie, you know, in a cinema, you know, and you are here, you know, having been given a pump action in the spiritual and the emotional realm, and you are now talking to me, talking down on uh, the question. It could be you enough. Know. Is that so? To be insulted and keep quiet. Is that so? No, okay, okay, okay. It's alright. See. Now, Mr. Man, it's it's imperative I let you know that some of these, you know, things are not usually the kind of information meant for our ears. Okay? Are you trying to tell me that Chief permitted you, you know, to keep me hanging there? Isn't for crying out loud, this is Chief's room, not Ikoko's room. We're talking about your brother's health. We are not here to prescribe on frivolities. We are not discussing frivolities here. Not trivials. His health, Chief Njamanze's health. Chief Njamanze's health is the most paramount here. And his health must be jealously and enviously guarded. You are talking complete badass. You are taking me to the highest point of provocation and honestly I will break down and cause earthquake. And it's not only earthquake, I will cause tsunami. I will cause Katrina, the highest quality. And if you don't take time, I will take you to the point of Rubicon. Are you hearing what I'm saying? And I don't want you to stand here like a scarecrow, pointing at my brother, because if you point at my brother again, I am going to dissect that your head and tell you that I also understand what medical doctor is all about. It's not only you, if at all you are a medical doctor, you stand here and deprive me from seeing my blood brother. He is my older brother, and it is nothing you can do about it. If you have to stand here and authorize yourself and command some authority, 
tell me you should have been there for my mother to give back to you. Are you understanding what I'm saying? Look at his head like a very damn gold skull. You're a gold skull, of course. That's why you stand here with your half baked ice glass to tell me nonsense. Fool! Don't get me upset, Mom. So you're silent? Enough! Stop! Um, okay. Um, the blood transfusion will take place as soon as possible. Both Chief and the donors are medically fit for the operation. Uh, 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 doctor, with this your analytical insight, are you saying that my brother is going to be fine? Oh, we believe God for healing, sir. Thank you very much, Doctor, for your timely intervention. I'm very well then, sir. Um, I, I have to run a long down. Oh, no, 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 don't be excited yet. Uh, what about the other thing you were about to talk about? Chief's children, they are here staring at you. It will be yeah. exactly as I said in Chief's room. Uh, uh, Chief's children, Huh, Lion himself. Um, Ikoko, please. My husband needs rest. Honey, can we go back to the room? Let me help you. Ujian, you should have given her more of a cup than this. You see this woman? Don't worry, my brother is coming. You'll be crucified, dear. And I know of you. Uh, the lion himself. The lion of Africa. Chief. Uh, no. no. What level of battering is this? What is this? This woman has always been cheating on her Uche, husband. On her husband. But today, it was different. Mm -hmm. She ran out of luck and she was caught red handed. Red -handed. And that's why we're here. Yes. And that warranted this kind of uh, inhuman treatment. Uchenna, how would you allow them to make this kind of punishment on your own wife? Uncle, this woman has no regard for our, for our marriage. Even, even the tradition of the land. Yes! And uh, according to the tradition of our land, which you know very well, she is supposed to face the consequences of her action. And um, hold on a moment. Um, I do go. What do you have to say about this? I know the consequences of my action. But when a woman is single in a marriage, she finds herself. I has no helper. It's allowed that she begin to act like those who is not married. I don't understand. Uncle, this woman has nothing to say. And again, and, uh, and according to our tradition again that you are aware of, she is not supposed to say a word. Say what? Rather, she should go straight to serve the punishment allotted for such crime. Um, DK, but I've decided to hear her out. Hey. Yes. Tradition or not tradition? Gone are those days when people are made to suffer for something they would have spoken their way out of. Careful. But that is not our tradition, no. Oh. Do I care? I don't care. These traditions were made by man and not the other way around. So it can also be amended. Adugo, please speak. Thank you, Chief. My husband beat me without no cost. I was seven children with him. He doesn't lift his fingers off to take care of us. Me and my children, we used to cut on people's farm before we eat. Those who are kidding have been sleeping with are those who are trying to show me here in one way or the other. 
Um, have you all heard her? Uh, Bunjamaz, did you also hear what she said? You heard her. Those that help her, in which way? Those that help her when Uchenna is there. Why will she allow someone to visit her local government when the chairman of the local government has not been impeached? Why will she make that, that st the statement? If, in fact, by law, this woman is an imperialist. Makawai Open and Eri Imperial Aligbo is an imperialist. It's uh, as simple as that. Uh, it's okay, Koko. Uh, I think otherwise. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um, um Adugo, it is said that you are caught with Andaman today. How did it happen? It is true, Chief. I did it. I did it for my children because it doesn't take care of me and my children. Um, you, you've all heard her. Um, do you still wish to make her face a consequence? Do you still wish to take her to the Igwe? You've heard her. Um, I will not be here as a Kajana of this community and watch something happen. It has been said that a man does not stay at home while the good delivers unattended. I will not do that. Uh, I will not sit here and watch this woman suffer such consequences. Because what does the tradition say about the husband who did not contribute to his own quarter? They would have averted this problem instead of making her face the financial consequences. Um, I think we should not allow her face the consequences. Uh, Uchenna, do you have uh, any plot of land in this community? Before asking this question, I, I think this woman has not made no point with the way she has been driving your sense and your psychological in the window store. You see, the, the, the tradition is clear on, on, on issues like this. Mm -hmm. eh? This woman should be allowed to, to face the consequences of what she has done. That is it's as simple as that. You know, we, because this woman, the way I'm looking at her, is capable of, you know, killing our brother, um, Uchenna. Um, eh? You see, if we do that, it will be a deterrent to those who is planning or even wishing to tow to her line. It is a crystal clear. Ego. Very translucent and translucent. Ego. I disagree with you, Iko. I disagree with you. And what does the same tradition say about a man who pushed his wife to commit such crime? Um, just the same way we think this woman is guilty. Her husband is twice as guilty. Yes, and I am sure that is why most of you here are supporting the woman to be punished. Because that is what most of you do to your, to your wife. No, I am too learned. So, so I am um, Uchenna. Do you have any plot of land in this community? Yes, I, I, I do. I have um, some plots of land, three in different parts of this village. One before the Ogene River, yes. then the other one at a uh, a, a village town hall. Yes. Then the other massive um, uh, uh, hectares near the the boundary, mm -hmm. the next community. Yes. That one that yes. yes. Um, we know it. In the Ujuko. Mm -hmm. Do you know where this lands are situated? Ha, we know the lands. Uh, no, the other one at the, the river, oh, no. the, the river bank. As the Akajana of this community. I will make sure I personally supervise the process of sale of this land. And the proceeds will be used to take care of your family. What I'm saying is that this woman is a very inuited, uh, in, in a particular form to dis, 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 dis your, your, your spirit and your, your, what, your heart. Whatever you go, go, I am done with this conversation. Just like that. We will separate the boys from the men. When the chips are up, we will separate the boys from the men. He doesn't know that I'm like a spirit that moves. And when I move, <laughs> it will be a public announcement. There's no problem.
There is this like a relay. The whole thing is like a relay race. Onye Bacha, I will give him the wrong cup this time around. I will make sure that he drinks from the wrong cup. There's no problem. Muabi Koku. Mirina Menchawov. Mona Bra. I must tell him the reason I am nicknamed the Pokemon in Hindu for We will settle it. Jaman mm -hmm. insulted you before everyone as usual, I am sure. If he had insulted me before everyone as usual, it would have been so preferable and normal. Jaman belittled all my opinions while I was there with him and made me look like a very stupid animal before everyone. He belittled me I was twice the size of an ant just because he is on money. And he thinks he can always have his way at any given moment. Hmm. <laughs> he hey. brought you down to that level. <laughs> but my husband, you know you are the one bringing all these insults upon yourself. Let nobody insult me vertically again. Why? What, what, what do you mean by saying that? What do you mean by saying that? But you told me you would stop going to that house. That was what you said. Don't worry. Benjamaza insulted me. He sorted the living dead light out of me. He was there using his psycho speed and I was sitting quietly watching him. He thinks that I am dumb. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> there is something we call psycho speed and psycho mode. The things that the brains can do and the ones that the hands can do. I will unplug him. I have the right size of spanner for him. By the time I turned it anti-clockwise, he would have been flat. And he will do it again. Yes, he will insult you again and again. The earlier you start listening to me, the better for you and everyone in this house. I was busy inside before your hysterical voice dragged me out. You were busy inside when my hysterical voice dragged you outside. There's no problem. It's an apparent problem. Historically, tell my daughter that her father is famished. I need water. But when the chips are down, we will separate the boys from the men. There's no problem. It is a cosmic arrangement. When the chips are down, the men will be different from the boys. Another person that I am going to plug out of the way, like a rotten kareka papaya, is that useless idiot called the family doctor. Dr. Cletus. Exactly that idiot. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Papa, what did he do again? Or is it because of what happened over three months ago? You should forget about that thing, please. My daughter, I will not forget that thing like you have referred to. These people made me wait aimlessly simply because I want to see my brother. They refused me. Eh? I had to push my way in because they are having tete a tete with Mirabe. Right? And when I pushed my way in, just like someone who had seen uh, Ijele in, in, in the market square, they kept mute. And they were waiting until I leave before they will start their discussion or they will resume their discussion in private. In private? Of course. So what could it be that they could not tell Chief in your presence? I don't know. I strongly, I, don't know. I strongly think they are hiding something. That doctor is hiding something. Yes! They are hiding something. So now, they could not even say it, even before Chief's children. I said that everybody were kept waiting until I pulled my inner strings and pushed my way in. Um, Papa, you are an intelligent man. Whatever it is you want to find out, you have your way of finding it out. So I trust you. Whatever it is they are hiding, wherever they feel they can hide it, I believe you will find it out. You will bring it out and know what they are hiding. I am enthused. This is my daughter. I am a pathfinder. You see, Jamazi, all their secret plants are all living in trenches. Like, like the story of the Magi, the journey of the Magi. By the time I step in, I will change the narratives. Mm -hmm. 
Hmm? That doctor is definitely hiding something. It's okay. He is hiding something. It's huh? okay. I've watched you for the past days, weeks, perhaps months. What troubles you? I am not troubled. There is something my mind is trying to wrap. Hmm. Well, you, you share all your thoughts and worries with me. How come you do not do so about this one? That is because it does not concern you. Mm -hmm. you, you sound cold and your, your response does thing. It's unusual. What my mind is trying to comprehend is twice as unusual. Excuse me. know what is wrong with that. I, I'm, I'm concerned. I don't understand. How do you mean? Mom, well, what do you mean how do I mean? Do you know exactly what I am talking about? Dad has been keeping to himself for some time now. He's been isolating himself from every other person. I, I think I have an idea of what the problem is. I think it has to do with... Don't, 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 don't worry, I, I understand. Yes. However, he has refused to talk about it with me. He has been avoiding me. I don't know why. Well, what do we do? How do we help him? What, what what exactly is wrong? I wouldn't know if he's not ready to talk about it. I really don't know. Perhaps I I have to speak to father. But I won't lie, I've, I've noticed that too, but I haven't really paid much attention to it. Men have missed the jovial, playful and ever-present father he used to be. Well, father is uh, very wise and astute, you know. He has, he has heart for his people and everyone knows that. We have seen him even as kids, surmounting more turbulent times than this. You know, 
I discovered he began to have this mood swing after the private meeting he had with Dr. Cletus. I could swear with my life that Dr. Cletus must have told him something that made him be the way he is right now. This is not him at all. Something is definitely wrong. But Chief, your first son is a bit worried about your present uh, behavior. He confronted me a couple of times. Um, me and my first son, uh, Doobie. Yes. Uh, Doobie is uh, very articulate, just like me. Mm. And um, he knows when things are really going wrong. And he's also this kind of person that uh, will always be patient to watch things to the very end. Yes. And I'm sure the reason he hasn't asked me mm. is that uh, he might think I'm supposed to tell him something or not these days. Yes, yes. And that brings me to the current question. You mean if I intend to uh, tell them? Exactly. Do you intend to tell them? Uh, no. No, for now, Dr. Cletus. Uh, but um, even if I would do that, not now. Why, Chief? You've always had the tenacity to do whatever I want to do. <laughs> I'm doctor, people think I'm a superman, mm -hmm. but I am not. <laughs> As it stands, um, I don't have the mental and psychological strength. Mm -hmm. uh, if not, I might crush in the process. So what do we do? Uh, doctor, maybe you still repeat the process and uh, give it more variables and see. If it comes out the same way, I don't have any other choice than to uh, Make it open to people. Don't you think um, that might be a bit risky? Or, or do you not think the earlier the better? Um, I think I, I would do it at my own time. If you say so, Chief. Okay. But, um. Uh, 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 Chief. Uh, there is something that has been bugging my mind and I've, I've not seen it in quite a long time. And, but I'm still waiting for uh, an aesthetic state of mind to communicate this with you. And uh, I think this is the right time. Um, <coughs> Ikoko. Uh, uh, yes, yes. What could that be? Oh. <laughs> um, this is just a dual affairs, though. <laughs> it's a dual affairs. Dual affairs? Yes, in two parallel uh, aesthetics. Two parallel aesthetics. Okay. Please go ahead and tell me. Oh, yes. Um, Jamazo, without missing words, I think that your sense of uh, judgment has become uh, too acoustic and um, a cake, or so it seems, uh, yes. Um, but you've never for once appreciated me as a brother. Oh, no, sometimes, you know, I have to do this so that people will not think that we have a master of our arsenal to attack the tradition of the people. You know, sometimes I use that to convince the people and confuse them. <laughs> but must you always Defend me by fighting me in public? Oh, it is what we call the methodological process. You know how these things work. You're educated too. <laughs> uh, Igoku. Uh, yes. But it is not yet clear to me. Oh, relax. <laughs> I know one day you begin to appreciate <laughs> and then begin to you know, bombard me with a lot of honorarium. <laughs> Well, that's by the way. Okay, okay. There is something you said you want to mention to me. Oh, no, 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 Jamanze. Not to mention. Something we must discuss. It is a must, as a matter of fact. Only yet. All right. You see, this uh, uh, jaundice-looking uh, 
domestic staff in the guise of a medical doctor. Uh, that uh, scarecrow looking guy is something I want us to discuss because his activities in this atmosphere of my brother's house and yet the owner of the house, more or less, uh, is still not, you know, in the comprehension, you know, avenue of his activities here. It's that thing that I said uh, must, uh, you know, come into 101 to have uh, a tete -a -tete of his activities in this house. And there is still something more to say about him. Um, uh, yes. Igoko, you've not really made any point. What but, did that young man do to you? Oh, well, you see, that man, oh, the doctor, is still finding it difficult to call him one. He has given me uh, this sort of a first class order. And all you do, Jamaze, is to sit back and keep mute. And because of my, you know, the way of considering things, I have considered your state of health and decided not to attack him with my vocal artillery. But I still want to tell you one thing. I will not give him such chance again. That green ground will not come again. Any other day, he raises his filthy tongue, you know, to project something I don't like, I will. Not only use my verbal capacity, I will still use my strength and throw a fist. <laughs> I am also a black belt, I don't you know. Um, Ikoku, that's okay. Um, okay. That's okay. All right. Um, Dr. Kletos. Kletos is not just my domestic staff. He's a qualified doctor. He's a professional. That reminds me. Don't call him that name. No, 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 no. Jamal, on top of all these insults he has weathered on me, I, I still want to, you know, make it known to you that your uh, psychological process and the total makeup is reflecting on your face. And that begs to say some question. What is going on in this atmospheric condition of our family? Uh, 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 why do you think what Dr. Kletus told me has something to do with my mood? It has nothing to do with my no, mood. No, 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 it, it is as loud as the trumpet. It has everything to do with it. Uh, uh, the world is watching. There is thunder in the sky. People are listening, you know, to the vibrative sound of the ocean. Uh, uh, don't you think so? It is okay. Um, Ikoko. Uh, yes. Let us eat granite. Uh, granite? Yes. I forget about that. There's nothing wrong. Well, Chief, uh, do accept my sincere apologies for showing up slightly behind schedule. Not intentional, though. That's all right. Thank you, um, you go ahead and tell us where we are guided. Um, well, we repeated the process the way you suggested. We also gave it different um, variables. Just like the way you suggested too. Um, Chief, I'm, I'm afraid the results all came out the same. Um, Dr. Cletus, with all due yes, respect, what result are you talking about? Um, Dr. Cletus, please, I want to ask, is this meeting for only you and my father or for all of us? Because if it's for all of us, then you may have to speak in a language that we all will understand. He may not have to speak in the language that we all will understand. He must speak in the language that we will understand. You see why I'm always skeptical with this your cognitive content and mendacious analysis? Have you seen it? Look, I've always suggested... Look, is that time you stop being garrulous, garrulous here? That's all the problem. This is the problem I have with you all the time. You've always been skeptical and unreasonable. Mm -hmm. I've always said this young man has a strict mentality. Okay. What is wrong with you? It's alright. Ikoku. Ikoku, you will not order the doctor. Eh? Allow him to speak. But that is clearly not making sense. Yes. Duby, I was still speaking. Mm. Sorry. Sorry. Um, you should all keep quiet and allow the doctor to speak. He has my permission. Dr. Cletus, please go on. Well, Chief, that's all for me. That's it. I, I don't understand. What's going on here? Are you sure of the result you got? 100%. That's all right. 
So why are we part of this? I don't understand. I, exactly. I clearly don't understand what you people are talking about. I took you. Uh, thank you so much. You can leave now. You're welcome. Excuse me. Uh, what, what is being here? Look, what exactly do you do understand? Did you understand anything? Uh, did you understand anything? What was going on? Did, did you? Let him wear the cap, Obus yellow. Control yourself. One name. Mela your temper. On your kid. You've not touched your food. And you look worried. You've not said anything since you got back from your brother's house. And I, what did Dr. Cletus tell Chief? I didn't understand what that useless idiot said. How do you mean? Could you imagine that that escalawag had everybody seated, like waiting for Godot that never came? And finally, when that idiot showed up, he began to talk. So what did he say? He told Chief that uh, the process was repeated and was given uh, different variables. And when the result came out, it is the same thing. What result? I don't understand. Exactly how everyone seated there felt when he began to talk. Uh -uh. If Chief knows he wants to finalize his private discussion with Dr. Cletus, why did he have to invite everyone to be present? What, what, what does my brother do? He's just to insult me. He holds out a sword that weighs 500 kg. And the next thing is he throws it at me. And I will wedge it and smile. Just because he's my brother. It's insult. That's what he's good at. Well, no problem. There's no problem. This is strange, though. It further justifies what I said the other day. That Dr. Cletus and Chief are up to something. And I will find out. Mm. Nine, nah, please. Let me advise you. Do all you could and find out what it is. Who knows, it might be for our own favor. But do not get into trouble. I am begging you. You know how difficult it was for us to get out of this straw the other time. Calm down your nerves. I will tell Njamanze that there is reason I was nicknamed Ipokunwama in Indufa, America. Please. Though he's my brother, but I will handle him. Okay. I will fix him. Please, don't get into trouble. Hmm? I said I will fix him. It's all right. Don't you uh, understand, please Grandma? Please eat your food. Eat your food. Eat your food. What could be so daring to seize the appetite of the lion himself? Dad. The entire forest would only be left in outer desolation and void without the presence of the king of the forest. Um, well, the lioness has lost her pride in the presence of her subjects. And she will continue to do so 
If her husband do not attend to her obscurity. We used to have a father whose eyes never closed in sleep because they kept watch over us. But now, more than ever before, we feel as though we are without a king and without a shield. Yes, Dad. Father, what is the problem? Was Father. Call me father. Father. Why? Because the Lord is about to change. I am still struggling to be ready for what is about to come to us. But father, what are you talking about? The doctor said you are okay. He said you are fine now. It is far from my health. Father, you're getting me all confused. What is happening? Are you okay? First, you are isolating yourself from everyone, and then you, you, you're saying all this. Daddy, your silence is killing us. What is happening? What's, what's really going on? Dad. Cletus. Madam. Tell me everything you told my husband. I don't understand. Don't try to play dumb with me. You ran a test on my husband. Which test? What results did you give him? Ever since you had your secret meeting with him, he's not been himself. What is going on between you and my husband? I need to know. Oh, madam, slow down. It's not that deep. Then start talking. 
I seriously don't understand what you're talking about, madam. Do you think I invited you over here for a jamboree? Madam, if this was why you invited me here, I'm sorry, I will have to leave now. You will not step an inch from this car until you tell me exactly what you told my husband. Madam, if you think you've done something wrong, that chief is confiding in me against you, why, why don't you confront him? Dr. Cletus, he is not talking to me. Please take it that there's nothing wrong. Don't, nothing don't wrong. just pull that pretense on me. Don't pull the pretense. Look, madam, I, I'll have to leave now. I, I do not want people spying on us in the middle of the road, please. Dr. Cletus, I command you to speak. Look, madam, you can't command me. I have a philosophy. What nonsense philosophy? I take all this from you, only within chief's rage. God, what nonsense is this supposed to mean? Sorry, I'm too late now. Cletus. Cletus. I was told you went out and um, tried following up. When I saw that you were in good hands, I decided to come here and wait for you. But I'm just surprised that you've changed your clothes and all that uh, <laughs> costume you wore. <laughs> Ikoku, what do you want? Of course, I built this office and equipped it to your test up to this moment, uh, of course, you know. From Chief's pocket? And that was because I did what you wanted me to do. Oh, I'm not here to fight you. No, 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 no. I'm not here to fight. Of I'm course, not, I'm not, I'm you not want to make it look like a tug of war. Huh? Look, I'm not fighting either. I'm not pugnacious. I'm not as pugnacious as you are. But I'm aware you are about to start pulling like me, at me. Just the same way that I'm aware you were with Mirabel. Of course, she has been on your neck to tell her what you told the chief. Oh, but uh, you know, somehow I am feeling so flabbergasted and a little bit uneasy on me that up to this moment I still have not known this other thing you told, Chief. But of course you know that I find things out when I want to find it out. How do you know I was with Chief's wife? Is that a question? Oh, that question is not relevant. Um, Dr. Cletus, it is no more time for gimmicks and um, playing hacky baggy game. Now is the time for the real deal. What do you want? To know everything you told the chief. It's not possible. I cannot tell you that. Uh, Dr. Cletus, I just want to let you know this. There is a reason I was nicknamed Ikwakinwama and Indufalik and I've been careful not to tell my brothers or even mention it before my brothers. So you must tell me every goddamn thing you told Chief else you... Or else what, Ikoku? Or else what? I knew you were about to start blending black like maker at me. Oh, your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> Ikoku, why are you always like this? Why? Why do you keep coming back to me over matters that have been concluded already? The matter is not concluded already. It will never be concluded until I tell you so. Of course, you know, you must tell me all these things you told Chief, except you want me to tell Chief and his wife or the rest of the family how you secretly, you know, got Rachel uh, 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 go through CNC. You made her go through secret abortion. Listen. Chief will not only have you arrested, you will be jailed. And if ever you come out of jail, you will lose your certificate and license as a medical doctor forever. I must see to that. 
What evidence do you have? Uh, Nothing. Do not be overexcited over this. Of course, you know, I don't want us to go fighting back about this. You know, I know how to find things out. I am a pathfinder. The choice is yours. Either to tell me or not to tell me. Do you know you're a body tact devil? Uh, Costa, what you are? You can call me anything you want. <laughs> I'm waiting. Hmm. Eh? Nice, so if this thing is true, that means our future is here. Uh -huh. Exactly what are you talking about? What do you mean by what am I talking about? Huh? Don't you know that if this thing Dr. Cletus told you, is true. You already know what that means. And I come here Yes. You know, I, I was not thinking along uh, the same wavelength with you. I, I, I think I'm happy. I, 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 you are beginning to use your psycho speed, and uh, you are being more proactive. I have seen the enthusiasm in you, mm -hmm. <laughs> and I think I appreciate it. Mm -hmm. I'm enthused. Papa. This is our time and our turn. Imagine you being the CEO and in charge of virtually all his assets. And I am at your right hand, giving orders, controlling everything. Hmm? Eating whatever I like. And, and, and what? Please just sit as you have seated already. We've not started doing nothing and, and your hope is as high as drones. Hmm. Please deflect. <laughs> deflect, please. I should deflect. Of course, you know. <laughs> well, this is our time. And our time, Papa. Mm. <laughs> oh. This is our time. That's what we are talking about here. Uh, I, I am seeing this thing now. I'm beginning to see and feel the, the visual aid of it. Uh, it's becoming to be more philosophical than I think. What do you mean by philosophical? <laughs> <laughs> Mama, you will bite your tongue. <laughs> no, she... Hey, that's what he said. Philo, philo what? <laughs> it's called philosophical. Philosophical. Yeah. After all these years, how could I have known that you were a disappointment? Can you believe me? I do not know anything about all this. I swear with everything I hold dear. I don't know. Now tell me the truth. Mirabel, tell me the truth. I am not lying. Believe me. In all honesty, I don't understand this. Now, help me understand this. How come the whole test result is showing the same thing? You tell me you're not lying. Tell me the truth or I do something stupid to you. I am begging you, I swear with everything I hold there. If there's something that's supposed to exist between us, it's supposed to be trust. You need to trust me on this. I don't know. You don't know what? I don't know. I said tell me the truth. When I tell me the truth, I'll do something stupid to you. Father. Don't call me father. Don't! Mom, what's going on here? Ask this woman. Ask her! You. Dad? Mommy, what's going on? Mom. 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 Don't. Mommy, what's going on? Really, what is happening in this house? What's going on between you and Dad? I can't comprehend it either. It seems your father's dinner still will be divided anytime soon. Mommy, what are you talking about? Mom, what are you talking about? What do you mean, Rich? Can I be left alone? Mom, oh, come on. Please. I'll fix this. 
trust me. I was sorted. Sooner or later, you have to talk. Sure. You have to talk. I promise. Okay. you say? Listen to your inner heart. Oh, you prove your words through your actions, not by your ways. Be wise, be wise. Oh, my mountain, to go to my own mountain. You are coming. Good day, doctor. Yeah, good day, madam. You are Thank you. <laughs> Why you told me about the phone? Yes, doctor. Ah. Madam, please calm down. Calm down. Uh, can I see what you have there? What about you, Zon? Right, here. Right. Madam, I'll get back to you as soon as the results are out. You put my Outcome, just say it the way it is. Chief does not share a DNA with any of the children. What the test was conducted over seven times. How can this be true? I have never cheated on my husband, I've never thought of doing so. I married my husband as a virgin. Doctor, I don't even have an ex. How can this be true? I believe you, madam. I'm completely bewildered. Explain to me why this is happening. I am completely bewildered. Oh, God. No. Being carried out. Mm. Your children's DNA do not match with that of their supposed father. Here. Mm -hmm. I'm really sorry. Oh, my 
cheated on my husband. What went wrong? Apart from our family doctor, you are the third doctor I have been to. So what are you trying to do with the mistakes? Let me say profit. Point Lord. Father, you know I have never done anything like this. I can't tell you. Wait. Because my babies has changed at the hospital. Oh, how could that be? The first one. The second. God, this is too much. This is too much for me. This is too much for me, Father. Igoku, as the oldest member of this family, I feel highly disappointed in myself knowing about this matter. For the very first time, hmm. it wasn't caught up in it. Why? <clears throat> well, imagine, hmm. it is not your fault. That wicked and cunning woman has been living in Sido. And we have just discovered that all her lifestyle has been in a Sidomatic form. Mm -hmm. But I am just in tune. And my happiness has gotten to the highest crescendo that all her clandestine acts has just been discovered. And there's nothing she can do about it again. So God forbid that our brother's asset be willed to those Senegas, those Escaliga works that he called his children. Uh, God forbid. God forbid. I agree. But the question is this. What do we do? It is simple. In Latin, it is called Icus Icarus. In another Latin language, it is called Kamikaze affair. That is, it is not a do or die affair. So if it is a do or die affair, when that time comes, we do it the Kamikaze way. <laughs> <laughs> I agree that we do that way. Huh? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> um, Ikoko, mm -hmm. what do you mean by what do we do? Uh, you know, you are used to bedding yourself in small skin. But I don't think uh, that uh, it is yet Uhuru for that. This woman has been lying and fibbing to you. To all of us in this family for all these holy years. And your life is so clement and sacrosanct to be attached on this uh, unholy mass of dexterity. And without me being fully involved in this rescue mission, you would be allowed with no choice of choosing between a sniper and a tabia. That woman you are seeing, whom you accidentally married, is the sniper. 
and those children you are seeing, they are the other Piapias. Ikoko, this matter is my family affairs, and I will advise you to stay out of it. Stay away from my family matter. I will handle it myself. Really? You ask me. Stay away. Why would he say that we should stay out of this? If he's just realizing that he's not the father of the three children, like we also do not know, why would he say a thing as grave as that? Listen, I know Njamanzi more than all of you. The way he answered me, in fact, the way he attacked me suggests that he's not just discovering. But that is the truth. Are you sure of this you're saying? Uh, uh, Ojuku. Yes. You are the oldest man in this family. Okay. I am just doing my best to let you be on the know of what is going on. And what is happening to our brother, of course, what is going to befall on all of us in this family. Have I done anything wrong in doing that? As a matter of fact, we will tackle this case as soon as possible, before it goes out of hand. Um, uh, but I think we should, you know, stay here from Jamanze before we take the next step. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh, DK, you know the estate where he lives. We go there and talk to him. Why, why would I? You, you should, no, because me that goes every day to receive the attack. When I receive the blow, I come here, you stay here and, and balance anyhow and throw back words to me. Go and receive it face to face. Go, go close so that you, when you, we hit you with word and with action, you will understand what. Do you think I go there to drink bon vita and soma vita? I go there to receive verbal action and attack. Ikoku, eh? You are not the one to. Chief. You have not said anything about what we have been saying. Isn't that a problem to you? Um, that's exactly my point. This issue is supposed to bother me more than all of you here. Because it is my family affair. So, I don't know why it's coming at this time. Can't I handle it myself? It demands a lesson. This is a very important issue. First of all, that woman must tell us why she stayed on you. Secondly, if and... And what? And what, Ojuku? I say, and what? Huh? That I've told this boy. Yeah, listen. I've told you, Ikoku. This issue is my private life. So I don't know why it should be an issue here. In the message, this is a paraphernal. I said, it is a lie. The manoeuvre is for us to babysit on this matter, but it is not going to work. We are not going to sit here and watch you unashamedly for that someone's children. And when the time is ripe, then you will will all your establishments and conglomerates to aliens. It is a Torah to do, a huge one for that. Who cares? Who cares? Did you hear that? Look at how you shouted. Who cares? Hey, you think I don't know your plans? You've always had eyes on my property. And your plans will not work. And it what, will not work. What is wrong with that? No, tell me what is wrong with that? Is it a bad thing to have eye on your brother's property? Something is wrong. It's a criminal act. No, it's not. I didn't call him a criminal. But it's a criminal act. In Germany, it is not. It is even better. Instead of you handing over all your life achievements to those total strangers, it's not. I don't understand. To what point are you trying to make here? These children, they are not yours. We know, and you equally know. Their days in this house are over. Okay, let me be the judge. This meeting is over. And the message is not over. You have not even been penetrated into the issue of him calling what? me a criminal. You can rub you Did you not hear it when he called me a criminal? No, 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 no. Who would take this matter to a standard family? Uh -huh, what is it? Oh, 
Mm, Mama, I, I, I came to see you people. What do you want? What do I want? What do you want? Yes. Organic Kisha. You came to see you people. Kedi Hebun Sobugi. What do you want? Mama, why are you sounding like that? Uncle has been complaining that I barely come around, so I. So what? So what? Huh? Did you just refer to my father as your uncle? If you don't know who your uncles are, you better go out there and start asking people, plead with them to show you who your real uncles are. Because my father is not your uncle. In even why? Wait, wait. Why, why are you both sounding weird? What, what, what is really happening here? What, what do you mean by that, that question? You, you is asking, it wrong for me to visit you people now? If you don't know who your uncles are, what are you going to pay? Can't say, look here. No, bring pen and paper. Let me draw your uncles for you. Can I sell you Anna? Anna? selling Anna? Anna? Is there a problem? Why? Why is everyone acting so weird since so, so like, I come in here? Well, what's the problem? No, no. What that's supposed to mean is that you're not welcome here. I have been careful scanning the the, the, the image here yeah, to to be sure that it is you. It means that you're not welcome here. Wow. That's what it means. So navigate back to where you're coming from. Now forget, trust that gate, go back to where you're coming from. Please, please, don't, don't, don't be offended. Did I do anything wrong? Are you asking? Huh? Are you still oh, standing no. there and ask? Are you stupid? Alanaigi, don't you ever in your entire existence talk to my father like that. By the way, what are you still doing here? Huh? But what is he doing here? Now forget to the gate. Back to your father's house. That is what I want. When you get home, you ask your mother, oh? Is your mother in hell, man? Oh, but I still ask your father. What is happening? Zobish. Did you people cook anything? We are trying to prepare these beans first. Trying to prepare by this time? Nine, nah, just calm down. Huh? Oh, calm down very soon. So this meeting was hectic. Huh? Also, also, yeah. You understand? Mm. And I least expected this idiot to, to stand here. I, I, just immediately I left the meeting. But I didn't expect that idiot to come here and still make me flashback of Papa, what I, I hope, have just left. I hope you did not fight with anyone. That is what I'm saying. The anger of this idiot I saw here okay. started from where I'm coming from. I, I know. I trust you. I, I believe you murdered them with your English. English. Namo! <laughs> Just rest your head. Food will be ready soon. Oh? Let's be fast. That guy has pots. Might know what Ikoko and his family said to you that gets you fooling. What is it? Mom, what's the secret you and Dad have been keeping from us? Excuse me? What secret? I don't know. I, I should be asking you. I don't know either. Don't lie to me, Mother. Now listen. I don't lie. You should know by now that Ikoku is a joy kill. Why would you even listen to him in the first set? Why? Say no to his gimmicks and antics. Please. Are you sure there's nothing I should know about? Oh my word, how do I explain this? Toby, you've known me since you were born. Look me in the eyes. Do I look like someone that can lie to you? Ignore him. There is nothing, absolutely no secret. Mom. Ignore Ikoko. He's just seeking attention. Please. Dr. Curtis. 
this thing will soon ruin my family and heart. You don't say. I need help. I don't know what to do. Everything you said, madam, I believe. But I'm confused about what's going on. You said you went for a confirmation test. In more than three hospitals. Yet the results all remain the same. Practically the same. The question is why? Why is it so? I've never cheated on my husband. He is the first and the last man till that on my on my list. I don't have any ex. He, 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 he married as a virgin? He married me as a virgin. Huh. What is going on? How do I tell the story? What do I tell? Honestly, I am breaking his side. Honestly, I, I, I wish I had an answer to that question. <sighs> From the cap of it, let him wear the cap of yellow. Control yourself. One Melody on the on your game. What is happening? Dad is still in his room. Maybe he's not hungry. Dad has a whole lot going on in his mind. And mom too. Maybe sure. you should go to her room and find out. Maybe I don't mean it. What you say? I listen to your inner heart. You prove your words through your actions, not by your ways. Why are you here? If there's a way to ask where I was, I told you I was going to see Dr. Cletus. Didn't I? I'm not supposed to be going through all this. You will go through more than this until you open your mouth and tell everyone what happened. Now, listen to me, Mirabha. I will not be the one to lose in all of this. You will be the one to lose. You are here shedding crocodile tears.
I am told to say something I honestly do not have any idea about. And I feel alone in all of this. Uh, listen, Mr. Contractor. It is rather unfortunate you made me lose him. Yes, you made me lose the other contract or not, and that he must. Please just say it. If you are not ready, let me know. I hate to help who don't know what they want. Look, Mr. Man, look, look, look. You are getting me erratic. This building you are talking about will be on a swampy area, another residential building. So just tell me, what are you saying? You look worried. Father, everyone in the household has been worried for some time now. Because we're still in the dark of what is really going on. I don't know about anyone, but personally, I feel like a stranger lately. Why? Obviously, you and Mom owe us some explanation. Um, do you be. You will know what you need to know when the time comes. If ever we get tired of waiting to tell us what this whole thing is all about, I will decide to walk away. No one should blame us for our actions. And we are not keeping anything from you or any of your siblings, do we? But what Ikoku and the wife told me proves otherwise. What did they say? Amanda told me to my face that her father it's not my uncle. What exactly did they what exactly did they say? They didn't really say anything in clear terms, but the father walked in in the middle of our conversation and confirmed that neither I nor my siblings don't belong here. So you see, I don't really understand what this whole thing is all about. Ikoko, Chief, I have told you over and again to stay away from matters concerning my family. I don't want your concern. Eh? Don't you understand me? Uh, uh, Chief, excuse me. What is exact tragic crime of myself? No, I want to know what is that exact tragic crime that I have committed towards you? Um, I don't know what you told my son, Diobi, but let me warn you for the last time. Stay away from my family. Chief, you see those people? They are not your family. We are your real family. I don't know what you, you're waiting for. I don't know. Delegate some of your assets to me. Hand me over your empire. Let me run. I am the most educated after you. You see, if you give my brother Ojuku some things to hold, you give Dike some things to hold, it's not too bad. And that is what I have been working on your psychological innuendos so that it will go forth and back to remember, you know, some certain uh, natural truth. We are blood brothers. Do not lay your strength on strangers. These people will deal with you. If for posterity's sake, something that will happen in 20 years to come, in 100 years to come, in the future. That is what I am working on your psychology. So that you remember all these things. You will say that you Ikoku. Ikoku. Chief, after all this your grammar, let me tell you for the last time. If not for something that is holding me back, I would have asked you never to step this your feet in my house again. Yes, if not for what our late father told me before he passed on, I would have asked you never to step your foot. Yes, you would have asked me, Ikoku, not to come to your house. You had me. Hey! You had me clearly. Ikoku, stay with me. Me, Ikoku, will not come to your house. Wonderful. Very beautiful. 
Your wife has been exposed. You cannot hide your truth in the mansion. You want to disconnect me from your family? We will connect in Connecticut. You are the lady. You are the lesson. I'm about to take the money. What an emotional truth. Let me see myself again. Is that the question of architecture? My uncle is because it's us again. What a drone of insult. What a cacophonous way of disgracing a prestigious man like me. You can imagine this kind of insult. What is more heavier than this in this life? Uh, uh, eh? no. Let me see what will ever make me go to touch his dysfunctional at the total of my agony he calls house. Let me see what will take me there again. Who provoked you? What is it? Could you imagine my brother asked me not to come to his house simply because we met on my on our way because I wanted to come to his house? Is that not an insult? Biko, Biko, please. You know what is ahead of us. Yes, of course. A robot jack of insults. That's what lies ahead of us. All we need now is to focus. You already know what is going on. Ignore him. Ignore everything about him. For now, let us achieve our aim. Biko. It's not a problem. Eh? By the time I build my atmospheric condition and move on the parallel way forward and backward, he will understand why I was nicknamed Ipokenwama in Hindu Palace. Start by cooling your temper. Oh, calm down first. Let us achieve what we planned to achieve. Have you seen? Have you seen my diaphragm in inhalation and exhalation depreciating? Look at your heart is beating very fast. Eh? But to but to right. own. It is not a kamikaze affair yet. Uh, please. Don't bring Kamikaze affair into this matter, Biko. Oh, no. Nah. Calm down. Father, you mean Ikuku is doing all of this because of the family business? Ikuku is a diehard cutthroat and a selfish person. He does not think of anyone else except himself. That's why he's doing all these things that he's doing including inciting members of his family against us? Of course. I have opened businesses for Ikoko, and they all went down the drain. Whenever I give him a small opportunity, he will mess it up and take the opportunity for granted. So, what exactly does he want? Because this, this whole thing is getting out of hand. He has always wanted all that I have. That's why he's doing all these things. But I know you will sit and uh, oversee to all that I have. Um, my brothers. Yes. Um, you could say he will not drink. Mm. So you should manage this little drink for me. Uh, of course, I said I'm not interested in this. That is why you brought two glasses for them. It's not as if I am, uh, you know, exempting from the, the cola you have brought. No. It's just that I am not in the right mood of, uh, of okay. taking uh, liquor. Take Jemans, yeah, I will take it. But that will not stop me from saying what I want to say. Um... I told you the last time we spoke. Yes. That you should give me time. Let me think of what to do concerning this matter. Jemans, we've given you enough time to do something about that woman and those children she's trying to force on you. What did you say? What right do you have to patch into wait, wait, our... Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I heard what Uncle Ojuku just said. What is it Uncle Ojuku just said? What Uncle Ojuku has just said is that none of you belong here. What? Your mother has been gallivanting in nocturnal act. And all of you are the expectant result of the DNA mishap. That is what Ojuku has just said. Father. 
Are you saying you're not our biological father? He is not! He is not! How is that possible? Of course, your mother has a lot of explanation to give to all of you. Mom, what are they talking about? You want to tear my family apart. That's what you've always wanted, Ikoku. Why? Mirabel! You have been working assiduously to tear this family apart, but it will not work. I am giving you two months to come out with the truth. Otherwise, we will throw you and this bastard out of this compound. Willy, nilly. Ikoku, sit down! Sit down! As you sit down, just sit down. This decision is not for you to make. Our eldest brother is here. He's our eldest. Respect him. It's okay. Thank you, Njamanze. As you've rightly spoken, I want to inform you that that woman has only two months to confess to the entire Ozumba family before we take our final decision. Thank you. Whether you like this or not, this is where we stand. Thank you very much. He has nothing to say. There's nothing to say. Our brother have said something. The most, eldest. What do you have to say? The doctor said your DNA doesn't blend with that of your father. Huh? Mom, you mean to say that father is not our father? I don't know how all this happened. I seem to be the only helpless mom, one in mom, all of this. Mom, really? Like, like, what, what, what are you talking about? You don't know how all this happened. Honestly. You're trying to say you don't know who got you pregnant. No, 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 that's what you're saying. Mom, you've been sleeping with other men, isn't it? Richard, don't talk to your mother. Will you shut up? <sighs> shut the fuck up! Mm. Isn't it obvious that what Richard is saying is the truth? Very disappointed! I don't know how this happened. But mom, how is it possible? How? When one loses his or her autonomy and independence of ability to control her environment and resources, they become a slave. In all honesty, I'm a slave to all of this. I don't know. I've never cheated on your father. Never thought of it. Till this day, he's my first and the last man. You have to believe me. Please make them understand. I am breaking his side ever since I noticed this. I have been questioning myself. <sighs> I've never achieved it.
mom has been cheating on dad. And that makes us bastards. But what I don't understand is why will she do such a thing? Why? I don't know. I, I don't know. I I have a feeling something is wrong somewhere. <laughs> really? Well, the only thing wrong anywhere is that she is not telling us the truth. She is not telling anyone the truth. That is the only thing wrong anywhere. Boom, 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 boom. But she said she did not do it. That, that's, that's what she said. Oh, really? And you think Diobi and I believe that crap? You think we believe we believe that bull crap of the millennium? You think we believe that? Huh. I, I don't know. But she's still our mom, so I don't know what to say now. But see. I am beyond disappointed. I am beyond. Richard, please. Just, just, just let me be. Please, I want to be alone, please. She's innocent. Why do you want to wicked her? You just want to disgrace her. You put her in pain. You put her in sorrow. I'm That's mother said. And what's that supposed to mean? I mean you are still on mother said. Will you shut up? Now listen. Let this be the last time you call that woman my mother. Do you understand? And the next time you interrupt my food, she will not like me. Wait, which up? How do you feel when you say these things? Don't you feel insane? Did you just call me insane? Yeah, you're... No, 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 no! in. did you just call me insane? Are you mad? Like, are you losing it? Don't you ever, ever in your life talk to me in that manner again if you're not mad. Please, bro, please, bro, just stop. Stop all this uh -huh. nonsense. Uh -huh. Like a woman hmm. that has nurtured you. Hmm. All your life is now a subject of hate and disdain to you. Come on! You're messed up! Check yourself! Are you mad? Like, are you insane? I'm messing up. I'm doing... Ha! Hold this boy. Hold this boy. The chair was just in your mother's seat and I was just trying to tell her to... And... <clears throat> you have to be careful. And who told you that woman has any special seat or place in this house? She is just like any of us. A total stranger. Exactly. So don't go about insulting your elder sister because of that woman. Because I will not take that. Do be. It's okay. It's okay. Dustin, sit and eat your food. They can insult me anyhow they can fit. Sit. They just have to get right. No, you are the one who is out of her mind. Aren't you ashamed of yourself, woman? No, 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 are you not ashamed of yourself? You are supposed to be a role model to your children. Especially me, your daughter. 
Your only daughter! But here you are disgracing yourself, thinking you're disgracing oh, me. Oh, Richard, don't shut up! Don't do that! You shut up! Hey, hey! Why are you mad? Are you, are you mad? Don't, 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 don
that. What? Which level be this one now? Uh, where did you get those girls from? They have finished me. My guy be coming down, no. It was a fear, Joe. No, no. Ordinary girls. Look, my guy. You needed summons from all your pretty comment. That was why. You know? Oh, I did <laughs> tell you that I needed uh, women now. Uh, what? Huh? I don't tell you. I just told you I needed to cool off for all that kind of. What's that my kind guy? Of... You personally dragged those babes down here. The last time I checked, I didn't ask any of them to follow you. You dragged them here! You see the way they get the bounce. Even said that size five. But that was what you needed. That was what I needed, <laughs> but no, that was that was like on the extreme. Oh guy, you be mad. What did they worry you? Yeah. What did they <laughs> What's up, my phone? Okay, oh, your phone. I have it. Uh, here is it. They left it in the car. Everyone has been calling, huh? Eh? Yeah. Virtually everybody in the family. Mm. Mm -hmm. My father. Okay. Uh, I see it. For, for, for. Windows, I ain't going back to that house. I ain't going back to that house. Oh, <laughs> even my distant cousin called as well. I see you. Let him keep calling. You'll be listen, listen. You've started again. Honestly speaking, I'm not in support of this. For God's sake, you are being hasty. I must say, you are being in the haste. Say whatever you like. I honestly don't care. So you go and tell those girls to leave them. I'm tired already. For what reason? As your errand boy or your younger brother? You brought them here. If you want them to leave, you go in there and tell them to leave yourself. Look at you. Look at how you're sweating. <laughs> it's not about you supporting me. It's about me doing what I need to do. See, the earlier I realized that my, that man is not my father and I don't belong in that house, the better for me. Um, I know you will be going through a lot right now. I'm not going through anything. I'm okay. And I do not want you taking any hasty decision. Just relax. Well, like I said, my darling, I am relaxed. As a matter of fact, I've never been relaxed like this in my life. <laughs> Knowing what I know now, I am relaxed, my love. Very, very relaxed. Uh, you know nothing. Do you know nothing? Yes. <laughs> I think you're upset. That is what it is. About what? <laughs> My dear, I am not. I know who I am right now and that is what matters. So, every other thing. Abiko, I'm okay. I'm good. <sighs> you, you know nothing, honestly. Um, Eberi, please, can we change the topic? If not because of the tremendous respect we have for you, we could have reported this matter a long time to the Ugwe. I have told all of you to give me a little time so that I can wrap my head around all this. We are tired of hearing this in Jamanze. Do something about it. Iyabualo. This is an abomination. You see, the also major is this family business. Njamanze has a lot going on in the hands of uh, aliens, strangers, and that is not too good. Um, I have capable and competent staff who have worked with me over the years, and I trust all of them. You stay here in the village, and you claim to trust all your staff. Do you really know what's happening in your businesses? You see? The problem with Njamanze is the intervivos trust he has for people. And that, you know, it's not healthy to do that. It's not. Um, let me ask all of you. What do you people really want? Exactly a good question I've been expecting from you. It was a great higher expectation. Thank you, Njamanze. Ikoku here is the closest family member That's right. who went to school after you. That's right. He is a sand graduate. That's right. And he has been running his own personal business for over 20 years now. That's right. Why can't you put him in charge of his own business? Why? Am I dead? 
Are you wishing death on yourself? You are the one wishing me death. I never said so. You are the one wishing me death. Huh? And over my dead body, will I allow? No, 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 no. Ah, no, no. Why would you say a thing like that? That is rather too harsh. Over your dead body? No. no. Are you the one asking this? Are you the one asking this? All of you are aware what Ikoku did to my other company in, 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 in a way. And you people asked me to withdraw it from there. They did? No. Yes, and you are not telling me to make him in charge of my company. Of my dead body. I will never do that. Uh, 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 I don't want you to go on and go on all about this. I know I was a cacophonous squander man, but that is all in the past. You see, I am a new man. I am renewed. Like, you know, we have old English and we have new English. This is a revised standard version of me, right? So you don't judge me by the past, right? So I want you to reconsider your impudent adventure and then put me in the front line of your business. That is why we're here. Okay. Set up your own business. Run it for at least one year. Prove me wrong. Then I will hand over the business to you. In Germans. The bitter truth in this matter is this. You don't have any child that will succeed you when you are no more. I thank you. Thank you. Then why do you want to entrust all this empire of business you have to those bastards? Why? Alien. I weep. I weep for my brother. Um, Ojuko. Mm -hmm. If that is what it will take, to prevent this wasteful human being to come close to my company that have labored all over my life, that will be left with no other choice. Would you say you called me a wasteful human being? You are a wasteful human being. There is no other word that befits your personality. For that you call me a wasteful human being. This is quite preposterous. And I'm leaving this meeting. No, no, let, let him leave. leave. No, come back. Let him leave. It is quite preposterous. In German. You cannot disrespect us and drag the tradition into the mud. What that woman did is called sacrilegious. She and her children have to leave as soon as possible. It's, they must leave. Exactly. Uh -uh. Exactly. Look at the way they are scattering the family. And uh, what? Have you also forgotten mm. that what you are talking about here mm. is my family, my own family? Yes. I will handle it myself. No, you cannot. What am Sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, brother. No. What am I? Is you okay, Kona? We will handle it, not you. I overheard everything. I'll leave. Rachel left yesterday. Do be left too. I'll go. Always remember in all this, I am innocent. You will not leave this house until I have decided what to do with you. Henceforth, you will no longer stay in the same room with me. Pack your fence to the other room until I decide what to do with you. Excuse me. What about Godson? You've not said anything concerning him. Listen to your 
in a heart. Oh, you prove your words through your actions, not by your ways. Be wise, be wise. Oh, my Mom, father is a good man. He's just under a lot of pressure at the moment. Hmm. His brothers want to make him send all of us away. I overheard them. I heard everything, Mom. Thank God, father is not a coward like his brothers. Don't talk about your uncles. But you see, they're not my uncles. I don't know why this is happening. I've never cheated on your father. It's okay, Mom. I believe you. I believe everything you say. You know, Mom, I've been thinking about this. I've been thinking a lot about this lately. What have you been thinking about? I don't know, Mom. Maybe something got messed up somewhere. I mean, something is wrong somewhere. Just like this don't just happen. No. Nothing is wrong. I've been to three different hospitals. The results are all the same. Are you, are you sure? That is why I'm confused. I think you've been hasty about this your plan of moving to the West. There's nothing hasty about moving to the West. I just need to start my life by myself, for myself, and um, with myself. Uh, don't get it twisted. I'm not trying to stop you. What I'm sure you know is like literally starting life from the scratch. Mm -hmm. There's nothing bad. It's having a fresh start. That's what I need, a fresh start. Restart. Well, it's okay. You're mature, you know what you want. I hope you are comfortable about it, the whole thing. You know, God, in most times you talk like a fool and an illiterate. You, Mitchell, I didn't come here for you to start insulting me all over again. Then why would you say such nonsense? Because you sounded like one. You sounded like a fool. The reason why we are here talking about this is because your mother cheated. Mom cheated on our dad. That's why we're talking about this. So what are you, what are you saying? You know, it is particularly disappointing that mother cannot trust any of you to believe her. Oh, Come on. really? Well, it is particularly disappointing that you have failed to see that your mother is a cheat. Do you want me to spell it out for you? She cheated on dad. That's why we are on this issue. It is DNA we are talking about. We are not talking about a medical condition. So there is nothing or anything anyone can say or anyone can do. It's not a miracle happening. But what was it you said you came here to do? I came here to see you. To see me? Yes. Well, you've seen me. Richard, why are you like this? Like what? Like, like, like this, like all oh, this is. What? What is it? It's not fair. Come mm. on. Have you even bothered to ask how mother is failing? Do you know that Doobie has been away from home for some time now? And how is that my business? Well, unlike you, God's sin, I've learned to mind the business that pays me. And you see all this garbage you just said now? None of them pays me. It's none of my business. Well, like I said, you came here to see me, you've seen me. So when you're done, and when you're tired of sitting here, you can go. Mom, in fact, she sounded and looked very comfortable. Defensive as usual. 
Rachel is strong-willed. That's one thing she has that I have to. Mom, that's not being strong-willed. She's been unreasonable and I don't like that at all. I understand why she is behaving the way she does. She thinks I have... I have disappointed her faith in me. But mom, how will all these things end? I mean, when is all this is going to end? I do not know, my dear son. In all honesty, I cannot comprehend this. I can't. Oh. It's okay, it's okay. Let's stop crying. Rachel. Hmm? There's something I want us to talk about. Okay. You told me your younger brother discussed something with you concerning your. You mean Godson? Yes. Well, which one in particular? Because Godson says a lot of nonsense. Whatever nonsense he said, I think I am. Reading meaning into it. Well, Barry, you shouldn't. <laughs> Trust me, you shouldn't. For Gotten is known for saying nonsense most of the time. Rachel. Don't bother yourself. Rachel, think about your mother. She has passed through a lot under the heat of... And your point being... You need to go see her. Well, Eberi, sorry to disappoint you. I will not. <laughs> I won't go there. Please. You told me that your your hungry uncles are gunning after your father's assets. Now that you and Joby have left, what happens now? You have given them access to your father's assets. Words came to us that you wanted to see us. I hope you finally made up your mind to do the needful. Um, if only you will hear me out. I am all ears and I wish to hear every bit of what you have to say. I have thought of it. Hmm. Um, you are all my family members. Yes. And I know you really want the best for me and my family. That's true, that's true. And uh, I have decided that... Uh, I want you to know that I love you. 
I love you so, so much. You're my mother and the only one I have. And I'm very sorry I... I deserted you when you needed me the most. I'm sorry I left. And I promise you... I will never ever leave you again. I believe you completely. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for coming back home. Where is your brother? Why is he not here? Um, Mom, I... I don't think... Job is on the same page with us. He is still very upset. Upset about what? It should be. I understand. Your father said he won't be in charge of any position until he thinks otherwise. It's okay. I heard he's about to make Uncle Cook with the new MD of the company. Yeah. <laughs> Why father still haven't learned his lesson is what I don't understand. How can't he learn his lesson from the past dealings with this crafty, old, wasteful, greedy man? I mean, everybody knows this about this man except my father. What, 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 what do you want me to say? Ikoko is his brother. Oh, please. His wicked brother. I don't understand why father can't just see the handwriting written boldly on the wall. Characterize people by their actions. In the go, and you will never be fooled again. Things that he or she is not cool with that, and we don't give a damn, we get that. That's what I love about you. <laughs> you feel you love me? Yeah. So don't think about that. I hope you don't twerk it really hard for me. Juby now brings Kiyoshi to this house. Mm. He's doing it to spite that. So, this is how he intends to prove to that that he's capable of managing the company. Is that it? Well, whatever he has to do to pass his message across. But I must say, this is a stream. You have to talk to him. You have to really talk to him. I, I didn't hear you. What did you say? I said you have to talk to him. I have to talk to him? Yeah, because he listens to you. Oh, really? Yeah. He's not your brother, right? If you could convince him not to travel to the West, I'm sure you can convince him to stop doing this rubbish. Oh, really? Well, I almost forgot it's you. Godson, you're known for saying rubbish. I mean, nonsense. So I wouldn't waste my saliva with you. Oh, you're spotting him? You're spotting him, right? Uh, um, Uncle, I'm busy here. Don't disturb me. Why are you looking so solemn? I have been in our bed, you know, waiting for you for us to perform our matrimonial safari. But my great expectation wasn't forthcoming. So what is it? A man whose house is on fire doesn't chase rats. Oh, you know, you're not a worker. I'm not a joke. 
excuse me, I don't get it. Whose house is unextinguished here? What are you saying, Nico? I'm asking you. Eh? When the hands are open in expectations, the heart is only ready in delight. But on the contrary, my heart bleeds. Because those hands have been closed in emptiness and void. I, I still don't understand. You, you, you have made me lost in your incoherent uh, navigatory in your oratory. I was told that in your very eyes, those bastards came back into that mansion. And not you or any of your brothers said anything. Mm. Um, sweetheart, honestly, I do not know what to do with my brother. I don't know what to make of Jamanze. I think that woman has him under her spell. And I have the power to demystify the mystery. I will tell that woman the reason I was nicknamed Ikokinwama in Indufa Nike. Stop it. Stop speaking too much English in this one. Don't speak too much grammar. Start acting. Make any fe. Do something. Uh, well, um, it's okay. You are going on a high pedestrian out of anger. So uh, let us quickly walk to a matrimonial bed and do some untold stories of the moonlight. You know. They are left on top because you know. Hey, hey, leave me uh, alone. It's okay. How she can just give me. Hey, hey, leave, leave me alone. <laughs> it's okay. I understand. Godson or whatever they call you, what are you doing here this morning? All the things I'm here for. I'm not here to see your dirty face. Where's your husband? So you have the guts to come into my compound to insult me. Where's Nikoku? Where's Nikoku? What is... What is this acoustic interference for? How dare you refer to me in such a manner? Nikoku, I know exactly what you, Mazo Juku and Dika are planning. I know everything now. How dare you refer to me as Nikoku? What? Are you expecting me to call you uncle? Oh wait, you are expecting me to call you uncle. You said it yourself, you're not my uncle. So why do you expect me to call you uncle? Let me tell you the reason I'm here. I'm here to ask you, to warn you, to tell your brother to stay away from my family. Stop forcing my father into making decisions he's not ready for. Stop forcing my father, please. <laughs> Can you imagine? Young man, that it's not your family. Oh. Damn. Your mother is an unbearable cheap slot, so kindly meet your mother so that she will give you a dozier of your health records and your genealogy. Okay? I know all this your stupidity, your amnesia, is because you are gunning for the position of the MD. Which I'm very, very sure that if they put you in that position, you're going to run the company down. Because all the opportunities. All the opportunities, all the chances my father gave you in the past, you wasted all of them, and now you're back, dragging him on the neck, asking for the impossible. Are you not stupid? Are you not mad as old as you are? Hey, shut up! I said, shut up your mouth. How can you come into my compound to insult my husband? Are you mad? You now get out! Get out! out. This one clearly mad. Stay the hell out of my family. No, 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 I'm warning you. Get out! Get out! Stupid get man. Get out! Get out! Look at him. Bastard! You already know his position. Don't worry yourself. So that epileptic idiot had the guts to come into this compound and you couldn't break his head? Mama, you should have broken his head. What got me so angry was that your father was standing there looking at that boy, raining insult upon insult on each and every one of us. Why? And he couldn't say anything. Why are you always... He could not say 
anything. Why are you always painting me black before my daughter? Why? Because you always claim to be a feeble man. Why are you supposed to rise up to the occasion? What do you mean by that? What do you mean by that? Of course you know my brother. That boy is not good to touch at. Because if you touch him now, you know the implication. My brother will come here and pick the little one he has given to us and chase us, us out of, of, of this house. Papa, that was then. Chief will not do anything to you if you tame that idiotic boy. He knows the truth now. Oh, father, he should take his stance that I wasn't around. I call me doc here. I call me doc at that useless boy. Your father here is afraid. He is just afraid. Eh? From the way he is going about all this, I don't think our dream of moving into that mansion will come to pass. So God forbid. Me. God forbid I reject it. Swear. Mama, please don't say that again. Biko, take it easy. No, 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 no. Allow her to go on. Let her go on her oratory safari of insulting me because she's a desperate woman in a mundane world. What do you mean? I mean what I mean. You are a good for nothing man. Oh, you are calling me a desperate you woman. You are nothing but a discordant speech. All you know is to speak grammar. Speak grammar up and down. But you can't ask. You, are you ask? You are nothing but a colossal pain in the ass. Ask it. You are nothing but a colossal pain in the ass. Ask it. Look at a small boy. A small boy. You are a colossal pain in the ass. And it's so heavy. And you couldn't do it. A colossal pain in the ass. You know my husband can be a weakness sometimes. From the way he's going about all this, nothing we talked about will come to pass. Alice, all you have to do is to give you just more time. The fault is not from your husband, but our brother in Germansi. You know he can be very, very stubborn sometimes. Mm. He has refused to set that prostitute away. Well, you are the eldest of them all. Don't you think the decision is yours to make? If so, I would have driven her away long, long time before now. Then tell the Igwe. That woman cheated and had three children with another man. Let the Igwe know about this so that our tradition will bring an end to all this. And you <laughs> think that the Igwe does not know about this? He does? Yes. That's why he asks us to allow Jemanze to be the judge over his own case. What does that mean? It means that Igwe and Jemanze they are together. What does that mean? It means that Igwe is on his side. Igwe is what? On his side. Jemanze's side. Hey. There we are living in peace. Devil come enter. Waiting your mother. I want to I've told you to stay away from Diobi, but you won't listen. Are you not even ashamed? You cheap prostitute. <laughs> Diobi is my boyfriend. You better stay away. Really? Shut up! Keep your mouth shut because your mouth is thinking, it's smelling. Yes, if you don't know, get that into your skull. So let me tell you one thing. Jilby loves me so much and gives me everything I want because I have figure eight. You are too fat for him. If you don't know, say I hear Colin. Tell is my boyfriend. Boyfriend indeed. What 
are you doing here? What are you doing here? You must be out of your senses to think your Thomas has to protect. How dare you raid my house with noise from your prostitute? Why will you do that? Now tell me. Is this enough that I'm trying to damn your odds by giving you benefit of doubt? Repeat that next time you see what I will do to you. I'll put you where you belong. Now get out. Those girls almost turned this place into a brothel. And at some point, I thought father was going to do something nasty. Obviously, he cannot do anything to me. <laughs> I know his secrets. If he disgraces me, I disgrace him too. G.O.B. You should talk to him as his father. He is not my son. He is not my son. How can I ever father such a rascal? Isn't it becoming clearer that he is everything in form of a bastard? How can he possibly be proceeded from my loins if he... Enough! Enough of your incessant threats. Enough of this, your incessant threats! Go ahead and do what is on your mind. Go! I am tired. I am tired of me feeling like I am at your mercy. I am suffocating here. Stop the stress, I am tired! Very well then. You know where you got this your bastard from? Like murder, like son. Listen to your inner heart. Oh, you prove your words. They'll not end. Come on, get out! Get out! Get out! Get out! Oh, what's the meaning of this nonsense? You're a despicable, rotten piece of rubbish! But what about you? Now what about you, mother? You made another man believe that he's been the father of his three children for over 30 years. The rest is not his. Do you know how ashamed I feel about you? Toby, if I lay a curse on you, you'll be doomed for life. Now you tell me, how else am I supposed to be doomed than not knowing who my real father is? Huh? And you chose this path. I've always thought you knew better. Some way. I've always thought you a good mother. But no! You are that mother that has brought this kind of paternal divide to a woman's peace and loving family. She's innocent to know Why do you want to wicked her? You just want to disgrace her Good You put her in pain You put her in pain Ah, Chief What a pleasant visit Do sit down, please. Oh, how are you? I'm fine. <laughs> Welcome. Yes. Oh. Um, so, what do I call this pleasant visit? Dr. Cletus, my house is in crisis. And in as much as I don't want to take any hasty action, I equally don't want to do anything 
that will dissipate my immediate family. So, Chief, what have you finally made up your mind to do? I don't know yet, Doctor, but I have not. Really? So, tell me about it. My brothers, you are all welcome. Thank you, thank you, Lyle. Um, we are all aware that the legacy of every man is as important as the pendulum that runs in his life. Therefore, it is of utmost importance for it to be entrusted not only in the hands of those who can keep it safe, but also in the hands of those who can carry it to the generations to come. Um, Ikoku here is my younger brother. I have faith in him and he is the next most educated in our family. And uh, Dobi is supposed to be my son. But you are aware of the state of my family right now. I have made my choice about the soldier arm that will ride the horse of my dynasty. Um, Barrister here has something to say. Of course not, Chief. I mean, you have said it all. I just need you to sign this. And I will make the announcement of the new MD for everyone. Please, Chief. I will pronounce my successor and as well sign. But I hope it's okay. Yes, you can proceed. The person I found worthy and competent to handle the affairs of my company, who can actually mm. take it to the next level, is. Uh, Ojuku is requesting for your presence. Oh, please tell him I'm still attending to my husband. son ever informed you that uh, Ichie Ojuku needed to see you in the sitting room? Yes, and I told him I'm still attending to my husband. Oh, what a tremendous impute. Well, your attention is needed in the sitting room rather than in the living room. Ikoko, go. Tell your brothers that I can't. I need to see to my husband first. As a medical doctor? A gyno? No, or perhaps as physio. Right? I don't care, whatever. 
I'm not leaving this room until it's well. It's okay, it's okay, madam. It's alright. I, I can't leave my husband no. like this. No, 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 it's she's a medical doctor. It's okay. You are the lady. You are a classic. A mother of a children. Cannot waste our time. We have other things to do. Ichiro Juku, is this meeting not supposed to be adjourned? I mean, why are you still keeping my children and everyone else here? She is unwell for this meeting to continue. On the contrary, we've decided that this meeting must go on. Why? My father is unwell, so this meeting is cancelled. Uncle, you have no right to make decision over my father while he's still breathing. It's absurd. That's like pronouncing him dead while he's still alive. Call it whatever you like. Ngemanze is my younger brother. These two are his younger brother as well. And so what? I ask. It's your And so just what? My husband lies in there in his bedroom, attended to by a doctor. Rather than you respect this moment as the eldest, ask the others to go to their houses and wait till he gets back to his feet. You're chairing a meeting in his house. Over him. I don't understand. What are you trying to prove? Listen, all of you. We are the Ingemanzi's family. Oh. And we are what? Imported noodles and pastas. I beg your pardon? Yes! That's what they are! Ha! Wait, listen <laughs> up. Listen up. <laughs> if you have no respect for my father, then you should respect the fact that he legally married this woman standing here. So you all should accord her some respect. Can you talk to my elder brother in that manner? Have you lost your sense of, of, of reasoning? Oh, you guys shouldn't come here and do all of this. It's not, it's not allowed. I'm speaking! 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 i am i am the, the dimension and physical absurdity he requires right now. I'm not this sort of, you know, unnecessary cacophony. But please, can somebody tell this family domestic influencer to keep his mouth shut or die crying? Will he keep your mouth shut? Uncle Ikoku. I don't want anybody to provoke me for that. Uncle, be coming down. Come down. down. No, but. You see this, your incessant behavior. I've had it up to here. Insult me! Rain all the abuses! Tell me anything you want, but not when my husband is lying ill! I can't compromise that. You know your problem. No one. Nobody has ever spoken to you the way you should have said it! Are you alright? What is your problem? How is it? What? Before you get to my husband, this is abomination. Let him be. Hey! So, my husband, what was the result at the end of the day? I was thinking you would come home without the announcement. My dear wife, relax. Huh? Sarah, Sarah, what is gonna be is gonna be. The battle is not over yet. This one, that chief is sick. I thought you said you... you of course, he was going to announce to everybody that I'm going to be the new MD. But wait. I, I can't uh, suspect that uh, my brother, Jamal, knows what he's doing. I suspect a foul play. A, a clandestine.
time one exactly exactly i've been thinking the same thing yes i was even thinking this whole thing is not true excuse me yes i suspect that foolish doctor is the one telling jamanze what to do you know he doesn't like you what do you mean by saying that are you saying that that mm. conniving, slippery maggot of a doctor has connived with my brother to plan all this? Don't be surprised if it turns out to be so. Don't be surprised though. My you know dear wife, for the first time you are using your cerebrum and cerebrum in a more vertical into practice. Yes, for the first time you are making sense. Hey. Why won't you just comment me of without course. insulting me? You were making sense because huh? I was wondering what that domestic staff of my brother could be doing all the while they are making their secret meetings. Can, you, have can you just comment me? No, 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 I have you. There is something we call elegy. That is praising someone for what he or her ha has done. This is what we call elegy. It's okay. Or all day. Uh -huh. It's okay. I suspect this whole sickness thing is fake. Yes, it's Sido. Mm. Yes. What do you what do you call it? Sido. Sido. Yes, that is fake. That is what it is. Fake, right? Yes. Oh yeah, call. Oh, apologies, gentlemen and ladies, for taking a bit of your time. You said the uh, chief was going to be with us very soon. So where is he? Where yes. Is he? It's not going to be here at this meeting present. Possibly it will be very slim. Why? She, she does not want to be disturbed. Doctor. Yes. Doctor. Excuse me. What is the name of this house? I, I knew it. I knew it that this periwinkle, this alligator pepper cook, Family domestic. Shut the fuck up, he's still talking. I'm sorry, I'm not going to teach you how to do it. Are you, 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 and sit down. It's okay. Sir. He said you should sit down. Sit down. Hey, now. You're not tell me that. I'm going to sit to down. Stop shouting now. Don't shout at me. Don't shout at me. Don't shout at me. Don't shout at me. He hurt you. I will not have any of you disrespect me again. No way. Yes. Don't cry me again. Good. Hey, 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 to disrespect me, I will deal with that person mercilessly. Do you people understand me? Doctor, you said that Njimanze gave you a work for us. Can we have it, please? It's here. Yes. She doesn't want to be disturbed. So Did you hear me? Yes or no? What is what we want? What is the meaning of all this? Yes. Go! Good and then go ahead. Let us know. What well, he disclosed to me that uh, as regards to the previous meeting you people held, that everything should put on hold until until his recovery or death. Oh, so upon his death, who did he appoint to be his successor? Upon his what? His death. You you guys are not okay mentally. Are, are you are you okay? I wonder. Is that the only thing you heard? You only had dead. But he said, Are you people praying for my father to die? Is that what this meeting is all about? Well, as the oldest member of this family, and the one who single handedly saw Njemanze through a school, I order you to speak. And with my own academic pyramid, as the immediate and the younger brother, who has a lot of potential. Upstairs, I am commanding you to speak or you speak inside your bed. Yes! Well, 
as his legal wife. Excuse me? You heard me. Who's been with him through thick and thin? Even when we came knocking on your doors, you scorned and stayed away. As the one who has sacrificed everything for that man who lies in there. <laughs> Dr. Cletus, I command you to hold your peace. Now you listen. My husband's desire must be respected in that our life, whether you like it or not. It is a lie. Miracle, it is a lie. First, you did not knock on my door. Neither did you knock in this door. Neither did you knock in Ojibu's door. You were knocking in the land of ghosts. What is going on? Are you alright? What is going on? Are you alright? Are you alright? Give me, let me turn this place into. Give me, let me turn this place into. Give me, let me turn this place into. 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 Let me turn Sit down, be quiet. Sit down. I should leave them. Listen, listen, listen. Okay. As a medical pilot and sole caregiver of this great family of Chippen Jamanda, I am bound by the promise I made to Chief and the oath I took as a medical practitioner. Excuse me. Thank you very much. Thank you, Doctor. The ostrich and My brother and Jamal didn't say until his death. He said until he recovers or dies, then Dr. Platus can make the announcement. What is the difference? The way you sound. You sounded as if though you were more reminded of him dying than him recovering. Huh. Is that not the shortcut? Well, what shortcut? My brother is not dead yet. But we can make it happen. Alice, are you going Nene? I'm only trying to help. What kind of irrationality is that? How can you advise me to kill my brother over possession of what he already put me over? Huh. Don't be too sure, my husband. Sometimes you don't think. If your brother had put you over everything. Okay, have you asked yourself why he has not made the announcement long before now? Because he knows you are wasteful. He doesn't want you to be in charge. How, how could you say, my brother? I don't know. Relax. That's not all. Your brother wants Judy to be in charge. Despite the fact that the recent happenings clearly fights against his decision. You and I know that if you and Dobi were to be displayed as an object to choose, your brother will clearly choose Dobi over you a thousand times. Despite the fact that Dobi is not his biological son. Alice. Uh, are you trying to say that my brother hates me? My husband, your brother doesn't hate you. You know it. You are not just fitting to replace him. And that's the simple truth. Now we have an advantage. What, what advantage? You are his blood brother. The next most educated in the family. That's right. But as long as Chief is alive, he will never look your way. And so? And so, as soon as Chief is dead, all eyes will begin to look your way. Then, let us wait until my brother dies the natural way. Stop building castle in the air. You and I know that the supposed ill health of Chief Njamanze is a ploy between him and Dr. Cletus. Yes, 
Your brother Chief Njamanze is not dying anytime soon. Open your eyes. What is Papa's plan about becoming the MD in Chief's company? My daughter, you know your father is a weakling. He doesn't have any plan. He doesn't have a plan? Then he should take the advice you gave him last night. You were actually listening? I was not, Mama. But I heard everything you told him. What is the difference then? So I was talking to your father. Instead of you to be sleeping, you are eavesdropping. Don't you know that you... Mama, you... relax. Calm down. If I did not eavesdrop, how would I have come up with this supporting plan? Supporting plan? What supporting plan? Nina. You know Rachel and I used to be friends before this whole saga. I want to rekindle that friendship. And how does your friendship or enmity with Rachel help anything? I want to make up with her. And once I've made up with her, our friendship will be a door opener for me to enter their home. And when I get in there, I will make them believe that I am on their side and not in support of whatever it is Papa is doing. With that, I will buy their hearts. And once I've bought their hearts, I will kick off with my plan. So what is the plan? Poison chief. Eh? That is my assignment. Are you daft? Eh? Don't you know that with you around, if chief's death is ever traced to food poison, which I definitely know that that foolish Dr. Cletus will, all fingers will be pointing at you, the outsider. Talk to me. <laughs> Mama, don't worry. I have everything planned out so well. Not even a fly is suspect. Are you sure? Trust me, Mama. Or don't you trust me? You are the lady, you are the reckless. I'm not a bad you then can get in your night, don't get in the room. You are the lady, you are the reckless. <coughs> yes, of course, I trust you, Chief, but um, I do not think this is the best option. Um, doctor, these are my people, and I know them better than you do. Let them wait while I think of a better solution to this matter. We've been keeping everyone waiting for some time now. Let their words more. But Chief, what are your fears? My fear is that, you know Ikuku, my younger brother, yes, yes, yes. you know him? Mm -hmm. You know his tendencies? If I put him in charge of my companies, mm -hmm. it means all I've labored for in life will go down to 20 months if I pronounce Jubi my son, my successor, they will kill him. And besides, my tradition forbids it. Ah. 
This is difficult. Are you sure there's going to be a way out? Um, doctor, I don't know yet. But um, you can tell them I'm not yet in the right state of health to handle issues like this. You know, in the end, it's my neck that will be sticking out for slaughter. But you are fit for the job, okay? I will reward you handsomely when the shifts are down. She's innocent to know Why do you want her? We get her You just want to disgrace her I saw you going Yes, um, I'm rushing back to the hospital From there I'll hit home Then freshen up Yes, I'll see Chief later this evening Or tomorrow morning Okay Alright, thank you very much Thank you um, Take what I said seriously on no account should anyone be allowed to see Chief. Please. No one? No, 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 no one. In fact, not even his brothers, especially his brothers. Okay? Noted. Okay, all right. Thank, thank you very much. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye -bye. Just been how many years now? Four years? No, six. Because wow. I finished school about four years ago and I'm nursing for two years now. Wow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> good, good, man. Okay, good. All right, yeah, darling. Welcome. Oh, okay. please. Okay. I hear okay. you. <laughs> Sweetie, how are you? Oh, my okay. God. Ah, almost all the time you got here. Yes, babe. Um, I'm trying to finish up the report. Okay, Rachel said to tell you that the food is ready. Oh, don't worry, just go down, okay? We'll join you shortly. I just need to finish up with this. What's this? You, you're walking? Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. <laughs> all right, It'll take time. Randolph, okay? Okay. Randolph, huh? Like I miss homemade delicacy, I swear. You know what's up with Rachel and kitchen duties? Oh, please. I don't know who was the champion. <laughs> no, I know, right? I beg you. By the way, what about um, Chief and Mom? Where are they? Um, Mom is fine. Chief is fine. Just that he's not been feeling too well for some time now. Oh my god. Yeah. How is it? Can I can I go see them? Not now. The doctor said he should be, you know, alone. Like uh, private, kinda. Of. 
Is it that serious? Um, not really. Just that he's under a very intensive care. Yeah. But the doctor said he'll be fine. He's getting better. And what about mom? Is she also under an intensive care as well? Oh, come on, stop being sarcastic. Am I? I only ask a very simple question. Uh, that's Saturday. <laughs> Mom is fine. She went out. Yeah, you stepped out. Um, nobody died. I don't know why we're moody. So what's up? Just me. Um, are you what what's next? For God's sake, how many times do I need to tell you to forget about this matter? Mom is fine. That is little and well, but the doctor has shown that in a little while he's gonna be fine. I want to see your mother, Tiobi. What? <laughs> Tiobi. What do you take me for? A fool? I went to that room to see your father, whom I haven't seen since two days I got back, and guess what? The doctor refused me entrance. What's that supposed to mean? What is going on? What are you all hiding from me? What could we possibly be hiding from you? You're also the member of this family. Kevin, what are you and your siblings hiding from me? Talk to me. Talk to you about what? I just told you. Really? Yeah. I just told you the whole truth. Okay, fine. I'm done. What? I'm done with this whole thing. What? You heard me. I mean, I need to go see my parents. I haven't seen them since I got back, right? But babe, we, we talked about it and we agreed to, to see them by weekend. Yes, but I can't do this. I can't keep living in lies. You have my number. When you are ready to tell me the truth, call me. Excuse me. Babe, come on. Babe, you need to take a chill pill. So that's what has been happening. My father is very sick now. And my mother doesn't even stay in the same room with him anymore. But is she still in that compound? Yes. My father doesn't want any of us to leave. He said we should stay till he decides on what to do. Did your mother say this whole thing is true? She said she doesn't know anything about it. So sad. But Toby should have told me. You don't have to blame him. You know, he doesn't. Maybe he didn't tell you because he doesn't know how you are going to react to it. You know, this is not. This is a very serious issue, and sometimes it's very. It's even hard for me to be saying it. I understand. I understand. But um, does your DNA? Diobi's and Rachel's DNA matches with that of your mom. Yes, it does. Oh. Then there can only be one explanation for that. That my mother lied, right? That she cheated. No. So what's the other explanation? I'm so happy to see you after such a long time. Likewise. Godson told me that his brother didn't want you to know about what happened. Yeah. I guess he didn't know how I was going to take it. But I totally understand. Mother. Leveled a cheat. Everyone said that I cheated on my husband. I have never thought about 
anything like that. I have to talk up to it. You're a nurse. Please, just don't hide anything from me. How possible is it that I've never cheated on my husband before? And none of his children has his DNA. I, I honestly don't know. <laughs> you have to relax and take it easy. Everything is going to be fine. Just don't stare at me at that. I'm just pretending to be existing. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You are a Amanda, what are you doing here? Don't be like that, Rachel. Don't be like what? What are you doing here? Rachel, apart from you and I being cousins, remember we used to be best friends. We shared a lot in common. We were very close. Remember, please flashback. No, I don't need to flashback because I remember everything. I don't need to flashback to remember everything we were. That was then. We are no longer. So, like I said, what do you want? Because I have um, something important doing inside before you brought yourself here. How can I help you? I, I came to see my best friend. You know, it's been a while and I miss you so much. Hmm. I... I... You what? I... Talk now, you what? Um, Richard, let her just hey, talk. Will you shut that thing you call him out? Please. Are you having a seizure? Open your mouth and talk now. You what? And see, I'm waiting for you to say something. No? Well, I, 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 as I can remember, I don't remember me telling anyone that I'm looking for friends. No, neither did I put out a sign saying I'm looking for a friend. Even though, if I am looking for a friend, it won't be you. So like I said, what do you want? Because if you don't have anything important to say, please, before I close my eyes and open it, just get out of this compound. Please, just, just... What are you doing? Please. What are you doing? Don't be like this. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know you're being dramatic right now. You know, right? I'm Richard, please. Hear her out. She might be truly sorry. Oh, really? I can't. I can't. And so? If she's truly remorseful, then forgive her. My friend, will you shut up? You know your opinion has never counted. It has never mattered. So please, pocket it in your back pocket. And shut up! That's how they deceive gullible people like you. Can't you see that this girl is a chameleon? She came here on him. You think I don't know your plans? You think I don't know what you came here to do? You think I don't know what you came here to do? My friend, before I open my eyes, just get out of this compound now! 
Rachel, I'm sorry. And you stand up. Remember how close Can you, you just stand up and get out? I'm sorry, please. The, uh, Rachel. What am I supposed to do with your sorry? No, no, no. What am I supposed to do with your sorry? To, I said get... Hey, to, to, uncle, to, Amanda, uncle, Amanda, tell your Amanda, cousin to get out. Amanda, Amanda, I'll Amanda. beat you. I'll beat you like a child. Get out of this compound. Are you mad? Don't worry, I'll talk to her. You you, 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 you think you come here and act drama for me and I'll just, I'll just fall for you. But then get out. Okay, hey, hey, don't tell me to calm down. You collect the slap yourself. Dummy. Hey, yeah, hey until yeah, when you get out, close that gate. See, you My friend, go and tell your friend, your sister to get out. You are the lady. You are reckless, yeah. Mama Raba, you don't get me in your night, you don't get me in your night. Onyanyuku, Mvinese, Bugogi. Wicked and greedy people, everywhere. Self-centered people, everywhere. They love luxurious life, uh, without suffering. They love lavishing things, yeah, uh, without thinking. Famaro, mancha, bobo, mancha, mancha. Obi di kwa fanja, obi fere fanansu They can do you anything, me pull up circle on yellow fire You're not looking hot How did it go? Huh? Mama, it didn't go well How do you mean? It was as if Rachel foresaw my plans Are you serious? That stupid girl insulted me. She insulted the living daylight out of me and sent me out of the compound afterwards. Hey, what? Hey, what? Hey, what? Richard did what? Sent you out of the house. Hi. Hi. Mm. I've never been this humiliated all my life. The way that girl humiliated me today. <sighs> my daughter, don't worry. Hmm? I know exactly what to do. They think they are smart. <laughs> don't worry yourself. I know what to do. Yes. I know what to do. Mama, whatever it is you want to do, do not step your foot into that compound. To avoid embarrassment, don't because... Don't worry, don't worry yourself. My own kind of war are fought without showing up in the battlefield. I know how to handle it. Don't worry yourself. Ah, you know what you're saying. You are reckless, yeah. Mama, Robert, you don't get me. You are the lady. You are reckless, yeah. Mama, Robert, you don't get me. You are the lady. You are reckless, yeah. Mama, Robert, you don't get me. Onyanyuku, Envinese, Bugogi. Wicked and greedy people everywhere. Self-centered people everywhere. They love luxurious life without suffering. They love lavishing things yeah, without thinking. Famaro mancha bobo, mancha mancha. Obi di kwa fanja, obi fere fanansu. They can do you anything. Me pull up circle on yellow fire. You are the lady. You are reckless. Mama Raba, you don't get me. Our wife, don't look happy. What is it? No, I'm not happy. What? I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy. I'm not happy at all. I'm not happy. What is it? Is it a problem between you and your husband? No, it's a problem between you and I. Oh, well. You mean both of us? Yes, both of us. Tell me, what have I done? No. Hmm? I've always admired you for being very courageous and strong-willed. But lately, you are like my weak and failed Waterleaf husband. What is happening? 
Alice. I still don't understand what you're talking about. Talk to me. Tell me. What is it? It's about your younger brother, Njamanza. Nine. Ojuku that I used to know would have made chief appoint my husband as the new MD of the company. Oh, Guinness. I don't understand what is happening again. If you have asked your husband, he will tell you that I have been trying my own very best. Has he not been talking to you? He has not. But I think you are not doing your best. I know you. I trust you and I know what you can do. Huh? You know how stubborn in German they can be sometimes. Mm -hmm. And I know fully well that he wants to hand over all his inheritance to that boy, that dude, that bastard of his. But don't worry. That will never, never happen as long as I'm alive. It will not happen. <laughs> Nai, mm -hmm. I have just one question to ask. Yes. You said it will not happen as long as you are still alive. Okay. Do you have a plan to back it up? Because if you don't, I am here to tell you that if it will happen, whether you are still alive or dead, do you have a plan? As at this moment, I must be honest, I don't have any plan, but I intend to... You intend to do what? Think and come up with something. I intend to think and come up no, with something. No, don't worry yourself. Uh, I have a plan. Don't st stress yourself again. Hmm? You mean it? Yes, I have a plan. Okay, you can tell me. No. Me. Let this be between you and I. Mm. My husband or anyone else mm. must not know about this. Yes, yes, yes. Eh? Mm. Promise. I promise. Listen, I'm going to see. To see Diamond. Both of you are going to somewhere. Look, bro, I know all that. So, you've been talking to Diamond? Yes. You know, she's my friend. So, so, what is it? What is it? What, what do you want to talk about? You still haven't made up with Mother. Come on, what if she's innocent of all this? You see, this is why Rachel thinks you talk and act like a fool. Like, I don't understand. Why is everyone trying to pity her betrayal attitude and making excuses for it? That is what I don't understand. Kibu, what are you saying? Like, why? Ah, come on, Jobi. That woman has suffered so much humiliation and scorn in the past one month, more than anybody can suffer in, in their lifetime. All she wants is for someone to believe and stick by her. That's all. Well, that someone will never be me. Why? Why? Because if I have a wife who did such a thing, that woman will not waste one minute in my house. And that is why you can never be father. You can never be placed father in anything. Well, if encouraging a cheating wife and making excuses for her means being like father, then I can never be like him. Okay? I can never be like him. Okay, that was rude. Mr. Man, are you sure what you just told all of us? Ichi, yes. a man of my age cannot travel from my village to this far just to stand before you and joke or say things that are not true. What's going on here? Mr. Man, Please, can you introduce yourself and repeat what you just told us? Okay. My name is Arun Zechikelwe. I'm from Obiagu village. Many years ago, when I was much younger, Mirabel, chief's wife, used to visit Obiagu, especially on the market days. She used to buy from me 
as my customer. At the time we became close, even started having affairs till she got pregnant. Uh, she knew I was married, but she didn't tell me she was married till she had her third child. She said she didn't want me to have access to the children. My children, look at them, look at this one, look at them. Can't you see they look like me? Um, excuse me, you mean you were getting her pregnant without knowing where and how the children were? Don't interrupt him again. Yes, yes, yes. Mr. So, Chikaywe, can you go ahead? This question will come later, not now. So, I did not come for the children uh, that time because it was... We had no issues in our family. We were one big, happy family. But because you heard that we're having issues in our family, now you want to take advantage of that problem. You want to add to that problem so that you can take full advantage of it. Who has seen that this man is a brother liar? Or am I the only one seeing it? Don't truncate this meeting. Don't you ever truncate this meeting. Else I throw you out of this meeting. I hope this is clear. So she gave me a lot of money and told me she doesn't want anybody. But, um, hold on just one minute. Why didn't you show your face since then? Why now? I have fought it. Yes, I have fought it for over 30 years and uh, I couldn't bear it anymore. So I decided to let it out, let everybody hear and know the truth. What truth? You bloody liar! So you think you can come into our house and claim to be our father? Are you mad? What's wrong with you? Stop insulting your father in my presence. Shut up! Richard! Please go and fetch Mirabel now. I want her here now. First thing first, Uncle Dike, with all due respect, this thing here, whatever you call him, is not my father, neither is he the father of any of my siblings. And Uncle Ojuku, my mother is not at home. So when you are done with this drama, with whatever you call this man or wherever you picked him up from, please throw him back there and all of you excuse yourself from my father's house. Nonsense. Mr. Chike. Chike. You've had all you told me. You will go home and come back in two days' time. Thank you, Chike. Um, I will come back in two days' time as you requested. Thank you, Chike. That's good, that's good. Yes, follow that way. Yes, that's the job. Good. So, you see, this thing is as. Diobi, Diobi, you need to calm down. Some strange guy can just walk in here and say some nasty thing and you allow it to get on the edge. Did you hear what that man said? I heard everything. But I can't be that gullible to buy that crap he just sold to you all. You mean I'm gullible? You know what? I really don't blame you. Alright? Because you have not been around to share in this depression and moral humiliation that this whole discovery has put my siblings and I. That's why you look at me and call me gullible. Listen, I didn't mean it that way. I am sorry. So now, nice. finally, the truth has been revealed. My dear, hmm. hey. I couldn't believe my ear looks waiting at the receiving side. You needed to witness the kind of pin drop silence that came on us when the man was doing his analytical inside of the summation. <laughs> Mirabel. Mirabel. I've always knew it. I knew it that that woman wasn't what she painted herself to be before everyone. 
Ni rebel is a chameleon. So she has been cheating and have three children from Jamanze. Hey, I can't believe it. Though. What are you not believe? Did you hear what I said at all? No, I was flabbergasted. Eh? So my husband, what has been decided now? I hope she will quietly and peacefully live with her bastard children so that we can take what rightfully belongs to us. Nothing has been decided yet. Uh, uh, why? What are you still waiting for? Relax. We are asking to come back when... Njamanse, get back on his feet. Nani. You know how your brother normally does his things sometimes? Not him. It's Mirabel. She wasn't in when the man was making his confession. and stay sad because you failed me. Nonsense. Mama, why are you like this? How can you be attacking me for no just reason? What did I do wrong? Because you disappointed my hope in you. That is what you did wrong. What if those bastards father didn't emerge to take off this burden from our shoulders? What bastard's father? I don't understand. What don't you understand? Dubi, Richard, and Godson's three father came to Njamaze's house and revealed himself to everyone. is this and how sure are you all that this is not just another framework what do you mean another framework eh what do you mean another framework are you a killjoy you better get out of my sight if you are here to make my happiness short lived get out mama i don't just know but unlike me i don't feel happy about this news it doesn't stupid. just seem real to You me. are very, very stupid. Who cares about what you feel? Huh? Mirabel, we all here have been waiting patiently for you to say something. So this is the man that got you pregnant and you don't want to say anything. Eh, what? Nine. Hmm? What do you want me to say? You all have already tagged me an infidel. You brought in someone I've never set my eyes on all my life. What do you expect a helpless woman like me to say? What? Of what use would it be that I even try to speak or defend myself? Hey, hey. Woman, 
do not even attempt any emotional game here. Tell us what we want to hear. What do you want my mother to say? What do you want her to say? Who brought this man here in the first place? Keep quiet. You just heard what he said. What are you trying to mean by that? He said, why am I? You think we can and uh, do something? No. Dr. Petrus. Yes, sir. You see what is happening? So, Chip, what, what are we going to do now? You know, if you don't go out there, things may get out of hand. You mean I should go out there? Exactly. That is what I want you to no, do. No, you should be the one to go out there. Me, Chief. What? Okay, okay. Better still, don't do it the usual way. Don't tell them I sent you. Just go there, whatever the man says. Tell them, just tell them what Chief said still stands. So, just tell them once Chief is recovered, mm. that what the man said will be tested and proven before it will be given acceptance. Chief, I, I don't think this is a good idea. These are your people. Why don't you go out there, confront them um, in this matter once and for all? Let's end the game. Um, Dr. Cletus, I don't want this decision in haste. Yes. Let's not be hasty in taking this decision. That's what I don't want. Um, I have something to say. Oh, go ahead, my son. Okay, thank you. Mr. Chikelu, right? Yes. Okay, very good. You said you had an affair with my mother many, many years ago, and we all are the product of that affair. Is that correct? Yes. And then again, you said um, you have other children aside us, right? Yes. Okay. So I have just two questions for you. The first is, if you claim to be our father, how old am I? How old is my sister? <laughs> and how old is my brother? Um, I, uh, uh, just, just, just hold on. Don't, don't, don't be in a hurry. Okay? Then secondly, if you have other children, why are they not here with you? Are they not supposed to be here? I mean, to meet their, their supposed... Um, Siblings. Siblings. Um, I don't think uh, it is uh, necessary. Uh, oh, or necessary. I, I, I get it. Because you think there is squabble going on in the family at the moment. That, that's why you think you can just use that opportunity to walk in here to claim to be our father. No, it's, it's, um, no, no, it's, it's what? It's what? Stop! How dare you ask him such a question? How is he supposed... Uh, no, don't, don't say that. Don't, don't interrupt me, please. He's supposed to know. He claims to be our How father. How old are your kids? Exactly. Like, How kids, old? Right? Because you How know. You know. Don't, don't say so that. I am the one chairing this meeting and not you. That's right. I have the absolute right to halt or allow anybody to speak. I I allow him to talk. talk. He claims to be our father. Let him talk. No matter of fact. We are having a family tata. The very organic sense of your brain is dead. Nothing but that. Again, this sounds to me like a family squabble, not a meeting. Plus, we still have a standing order from Chief Njameza himself. And that automatically imposes every other ad hoc or contingent meeting in the interim. And it remains so until either of the lead down conditions are duly satisfied. This meeting is over. It's not over unless you want me to reverse the third world warfare and induce POW without order. I am an academic no, warlord and a war veteran. Yes, that's what I am. Can somebody help me to throw this? Why are you still here? You all do not behave yourself. Why not? 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 Why not
are you doing here? What are you still doing here? Yes. To read where you are going to call the police to arrest this bonita prescribed. Please, they should just call the police. Somebody should just call the police. Don't move any. You are the one that is running first in the we believe you we believe you god knows that i've never set my eyes on that man before believe me Mommy, i don't know who is doing this see someone is trying to tear my family apart <sighs> It's okay, it's okay. What have I done? It's okay. Come on. Like Rachel said, we believe you and that's all that matters. But I feel, I feel I'm losing my family already. Oh Mommy, listen, listen. I have a feeling that this will come to an end very soon. All this will, 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 will amount to victory. Okay? <laughs> you know when it's getting tough, that's when it's getting better. Okay. Mom, <laughs> Mom, 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 please stop it's okay. crying. It's okay, it's okay. Mom. It's okay, Mom, it's okay. Mommy, mm. Mommy, it's okay, please. Okay? See, there's a bad news though. Uh, uh, Richard. What? What bad news? Mm -hmm. What bad news? Mom, you're overreacting. Stop now. Is Joby all right? Just keep on stop. I overheard Uncle Ikobu, DK and Ojuko come to a consensus. What consensus? What consensus? Now, I am honestly not happy about the way things went at that meeting. I could not have had you in that meeting and things still went that way. That was not our plan. Yes. That was not our plan. But as you can see, things have gone beyond my control. That doctor of a man almost called the police on us. This is arrant nonsense. Yes! Ojuku, look at what you are saying. You are sounding like my husband. Look at you. How am I sounding? Stupid. Afraid. Foolish. Enough! Enough, woman. Go home. Go home and rest. Tomorrow is another day. Which tomorrow? Which tomorrow? I heard you hotel the meeting out in Jamaze is back on his feet. And you are here telling me tomorrow. Which tomorrow? Eh? Alice, I've had you up to here. I say go home before I do something stupid. You are the lady. You are the lady. You are the lady. You are the lady. I've always known that Ikoko is desperate. I never knew it's this much. I overheard everything. I heard them saying it all. But mom, listen to me. I promise you today, we will never let anyone come into this house to take what belongs to you or what belongs to us. Do you understand? Mama, listen. Nobody is tearing your home apart and nobody is taking what belongs to you. Joby still Do you doesn't believe that I'm innocent in all this. Come on, Mom. You don't need to worry about Joby. I believe Diamond is doing a tremendous job to that aspect. To what aspect? Diamond has been talking to Diobi, trying to convince him to change his mind. And I believe he will come to his senses soon. Oh. Why is all this happening? No, it's okay. Why? No, can you, can you stop I've been talking? faithful. No, okay. I've known just your father. No, no, all no. my life. I said, I he watched me grow to this extent. Mom, you should go now. It's okay. Everything about me, even the breath I take every day, is for him. How could this happen? Mom, stop crying. Yes, come in. We have come to live forever. 
So, come inside, come inside, come inside. Occupy until our enemies are submitted. What is going on here? What does, what does it, this? What does it look like it's going on here? What's going on about this? You people keep asking useless questions. You know, you can, 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 don't, don't, don't you know that we have come here? You have come here to stay. Are, what? What, yes. what is this? We have come to stay. Ha, you don't, Joby! Reach out! Joby! This is what we call cream de la cream. Yeah. Sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, 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 I'm it is the, the, yes, that yeah. is the, the we call it upper room. Yeah, we we'll call it upper basement. Oh, that one. Hey. So uh, in my father and brother's house now, mm -hmm. so many rooms. You choose here. Yeah, I choose right? that one. You this choose one. this one. Yeah. It is called grill. <laughs> it is called grill room. Chef, honestly. I think this whole thing should be over by now. Because your house is literally on fire. Listen, Dr. Cletus. The last thing you will do is to think I don't know what I'm doing. You see, uh, my younger brother, Ikoku, and his spray singers, they think they are smarter than me. Relax, I am still in control of everything. If I'm scared, I'm really, really scared. Honestly. I am not scared. I am still trying to wrap my head around something I want to do. Yes. Oh, really? You want to share? No. Not now. Chief, I do not know what you're thinking about. I don't see this going on well. I do not think I see this going on well. I must be frank with you. Um. my plate not where I kept it? Why is it over here? When you get to a place near me, you learn to ask questions. It's very important. Except your map. Richard, what nonsense are you talking about? <laughs> huh? This thing you just said now, what does this have to do with my plate not being where I kept it before going to get this water? Are you not the one going mad? Don't call me chief. Call me father. Yes, Father. This food? Yes, yes, madam. I can pursue the aroma of the food. <laughs> it's, it's like the food, the kind of food you make. Dad. The house is getting overheated by the day. We can't wait for you to get back on your feet. The house needs you, everybody. We need you. We need you back.
going on there? Huh? Can you imagine this stupid girl? <laughs> Richard, what is it? Woman, I would suggest you teach your daughter, or rather, show her where to get senses, because I'm sure you don't have any to teach her. Are you, you, you are talking to like that? Did you just refer to my mother as woman? Rachel, have you lost it? Have you gone bananas? Are you mad? No, don't, don't spit into my face. Oh, you are stupid. Eh? Don't spit into my face. You are stupid. Rachel. I am talking to you. Stop it. I am talking to you. Listen. Is it me you are talking to like that? Are you out of your senses? Are you mad? If, if, if I slap try, you. Try it. Hmm. No, try it now. Slap her. What is going on here? Why, why can't I have rest of mind? Well, excuse me, you don't have the bowels to do this. You must be very stupid. Hmm. Is it control mind? your family. Control, if you must be in this house, control your family or I will throw you guys out of this house. Are hey, people mad? Who's, who's family? Why can't I have rest of mind in my own house? The first son of Njamanze is talking. Oh, Look pity, at them. Pity. Who's, oh. who's first son? I won't warn you again. Put your dogs on a leech. Put your dogs on a leech. I'm warning you. Hmm. Look at this bastard. Is, is your, gener your generation is bastard? Oh, if you don't know that you are a bastard, your generation is a bastard. You are 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 a bastard. And how about you? What? Go to a place. You don't know what? you stand with one leg. You don't know you stand with one leg before you balance with the both legs. You want to see what sense is this? Yeah. Yeah. You want to see what sense is this? Bitches! 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 Where is the red SUV you just packed here? I don't know. I'm, I'm surprised. Godson! Godson! No, I'm not sure Godson would do such a thing because I already told him I'm supposed to leave with the car. Uh, but then let me call him first. Uh, <laughs> maybe he just left. I told you. It's obviously him. <laughs> For selfish interest Because of money You don't know yourself Because of Ethelic things She love you Oh, one of them Oh, one of them For selfish interest I'm one of them I'm one of them I'm one of them I'm one of them you went out with my brother's car. No. He went out with your grandfather's car. <laughs> um, Uncle, uh, in as much as you're trying to exercise so much right and leverage, please do not include my car on this, okay? I personally shift this car with my money. So next time, don't drive it out without my permission. Please, mm -hmm. if you insult me further, I will make sure that your hand will not touch this key to this machine forever in your life. <laughs> Uncle, yeah. that is impossible. I said it is impossible. You have no right to withhold his khaki. Give back his khaki. What's all this nonsense? Will you shut up your mouth? Did he buy it with his money or my husband's money? Okay, let's assume that you all are daft. But did you hear the parts where I said, that I personally shipped this car all the way from the US with my hat and money. Can I have the car key? No, let's go. And if he doesn't give it to me, will you shut that thing? Oh, you shut your mouth! 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 Where? Uh. The 
floor is yours. Go ahead, please. Uh, uh, thank you, Leo Jiko. No, 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 no. I don't want to sit down. I want to stand up so that my talk will stand up. Uh, 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 as I was saying, Leo uh, Jiko, I did nothing wrong to this boy. Before I knew it, this boy jacked me up and ascended me to the point of Rubicon. As that was not enough, he suspended me there on air for hours. As I was frantically crying for help, an angel appeared to us. The angel begged this boy not to let me fall. This boy did not listen. He refused blatantly and allowed me to crash on the ground in now my waist has been a combat. All my joints and ligaments have been cam alienated. This is an abomination. We have not seen a thing like this before. And so, Joby must face the consequence. He will face nothing. Yes! Read my lips. He is not going to face any consequences. You've all seated here conniving and supporting each other against my family. Has any of you cared to ask why Diobi did what he did? That is not enough justifiable reason to do what he did. Well, it is! It is! Take it or leave it. It is. Nonsense. Enough of this rubbish. Um. <clears throat> See, I'm not going to sit here to listen to your partial judgment, old man. You see, at first, I do not have a problem with my uncle taking his family out with my car. The problem I have is his approach. You needed to have heard the way he spoke to me rudely for asking for my car key. Shut Ta up! <sighs> you have no reason to beat up your uncle. Two, it is high time I began to. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Did, did, did you really hear what I just said? Nothing on earth will make you to beat up your uncle. That's what I said. Simply because you drove your car. That's all you have to say. Oh, hold on a minute. I'm not finished. As from today, you are forbidden from touching that car. That should be your punishment. Oh, for that's my own car. Oko, it's not possible. Oko, you have no right to pass such judgment. That car belongs to my brother. He bought that car with his hard-earned money. In fact, he shipped that car from the US. He shipped that car directly to me. So he can't pass such judgment. It's not possible. It's, it's, did you, did you it's, hear what God said just said? I did. And that's all you have to say. Bananas? Didn't you hear what our older brother Juku said? Give me my key. This boy, I have seen that you are out of trouble. You are out for trouble. If you go close to that car, I will shoot you. Give me my car. I will shoot you! Is it no, your no, car? No, no. I will. Just, 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 Is it your car? Let it go. Please. Leave it. Leave that car. Don't no, start don't what you cannot finish. Give me the key. Now. I will not. I will not. Give me the keys. Let it 
Now! Now I don't oh, give him the khaki. Don't give him Okay, I like that. Uh -huh. Yeah, you can with also. Come and drive car! Give me the car! Give me the car! Come and drive! Papa, I can leave my sister up and you should have shut his leg! No, 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 no. You should have shut his leg! You no. shut! You don't no, no, no. want your elder! son of my right hand. There are things I must tell you before I join my ancestors. Father, you scare me when you speak in this manner. You promised you will never leave in sickness. You said you would join your ancestors in good health. That was what you said to me, Father. I will not die. But you must be there and strong to hold me when I fall. The family business and the people needed to be strong and astute, just like your father. Father, you are strong. You are resilient. You are brave. You are full of wisdom. All my life I walk every day towards being like you. My son, you will not be like me. You will be your own king. You will reign in this great empire which I have built all my life. But watch out for the insider. His heart is evil. Father, the more I pay attention, the more confused I, I get. What do you mean by holding you when you fall? And then, who is the insider?
about this. What did he say? They told me to be aware of the insider. Baby, the truth is, I'm beginning to get very uncomfortable about this whole thing. What if he had shot you or you shot him? And by the way, how did you even get hold of a gun? How did you get hold of a gun? Babe, just... I should take a chill pill. I should relax. Tell me, how am I supposed to relax? How? Okay. Relax. Eh? My husband, did you say relax? No! This is not the time to relax. In fact, I like the way you are doing now. I want to commend you now that you are doing very well. You are now proving to be the Ikoku that I married. I like the way you are unleashing the beast in you. You are telling them that you are that lion of a husband that I got married to. Huh? You see, with this type of ginger, whenever your brother gets better, and want to address this matter, you will be enough threat to whatever bad judgment he may want to pass. Believe it. You know, I'm not comfortable, you know, with that my unethical spectacular performance over there. Uh, if my brother were to be in his best state of health, he would not entertain this sort of, you know, destructive chaos in his house. This is exactly... My brother is a man of peace. Listen, listen. This is exactly the problem I always have with you. Whenever people start praising you for the good things you have done, you will just feel you are not doing the right thing. And it's not good. It's not good at all. Stop it. Stop it. This is not the time to do that. Biko. Alice, I am not cut out for all this. Bon voyage. Where are you going? Eh? Best of man, historian, apology. What is all this? Eh? Why do you want to waste this opportunity now? Look at it. Eh? The time we all have been waiting for is here now. Look at what you're doing. Hey! This man, this man, eh? I thought you are not coming again. Don't worry, my dear. My husband delayed me. I must really thank you for the way you played your card. Honestly, you are very good. Yes, I must commend you in that. But I was so scared the two times you came to Chief's house. Scared? Yes. Why were you scared? I was, I was so scared, though. Honestly. But I was watching you you are really good in what you do. Honestly, you know what you're doing. Yes. Um, <laughs> don't mention Alice. I, I, I brought your balance. I was only doing what I know how mm -hmm. to do best. Just doing my job. How much is it? It's 250,000 Naira. 250,000? Why? This is not our agreement. What was our agreement? Our agreement was 1 million Naira. You gave me 500,000 Naira before the job was done. And now my balance is supposed to supposed be... Supposed to be what? Chikelue, you are an ingrate. So you expected me to raise 1 million Naira for you. Have you ever earned 250,000 Naira in a whole year? You want to come and earn 1 million Naira in just two weeks. Is that not robbery? Call it whatever you like, Alice. I need my balance the way we discussed it. Else! Else what? Shut up! 
I was only joking. I don't like that type of joke, ah. Alice. I'm sensitive to my money. Don't worry. You see, my husband took part of the money. In fact, that was the reason I came late. Eh? He took part of the money. But don't worry, I will make some withdrawal tomorrow and get you your balance, okay? That's more like it. <laughs> um, I think I'll be going now. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, you say tomorrow. I give you my word. Don't give me your word, Alice. I want my money. Don't worry yourself. Your money must get to you. Okay. Hmm? I'll be going. It's all right. All right. Unfortunately, instead of his health improving, he's deteriorating. And on this basis, as the oldest member of this family, and in German, the eldest brother, I have decided. Our uh, uncle, you cannot. Shut up. And listen to the elder speak. Why are you always taking delight in his subordination and rebellion when an elder talks? Children like you doesn't live long. Oh, oh. My brother will live long. How can one's uncle be praying for, 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 for him to, to, to die young? The only thing he knows how to do is to speak English. When others were making money, he didn't, he didn't want you to make the Don't money. Don't mind them. Anyway, they did, they will whatever that is, okay? I must remind us what father said. And I don't think that has changed. I respect what my brother said. We are going to do exactly what he said. In fact, that's why I call this meeting. If I might ask, mm. what is the meaning of this meeting? What is it supposed to be? If I answer that question. God sir. Yes, uncle. You are the only one that is allowed by Njemanze to see him. Did he tell you anything of recent? I don't understand. What sort of question is that? Stop asking my brother's question with question. Answer his question. My friend, answer my question. My father did not tell me anything. Who? I decided that Chike Lue will be running a DNA test with all of you, three of you. And if the DNA proves that you are his, then that will put a pay stop to all this argument. But neither I nor any of my siblings will agree to that nonsense. As far as I'm concerned, that man was paid to do what he did. There's no atom of similitude. In, 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 exactly. uh, and you're telling me that, that, that he's my father. Are, are, are we daft? You think we are daft? It are we is fools? Bad. Because I don't look like that man. And I'm suspecting you. You see you, I'm suspecting you. Why don't you bring that lunatic to come and claim to be, be, be whose father? You paid, you paid someone to come and act. <laughs> this guy is... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whether you like it or not, this DNA test must be carried out and this will settle it finally. Ikoku, active in service. You will get to inform this family doctor of what the latest development is. He has to be present when this DNA test is being conducted. I don't want anybody to say it is being manipulated or forged or whatever. I will do as you have just instructed. I'll do that. This meeting is over. Yeah? Yes. Doctor, what did my father say? 
But my son, the test will go on. The test will go on? Yeah, but you don't have any reason to worry. I am sure that must be another scheme by Ikokua, his cohort. Trust me, uh, Dr. Clayton here will handle it. But father, who is that man? The one who claims to be your father. Exactly. Yeah, well, like I said, do not worry yourself. No matter what happened, you must all remain my children, just like all these years. Your father, you know with all these things that are going... I know that, but your father needs to rest on some point. What are we fighting for? What are we dragging for? Give me kinda chani. Give me kinda sabi no What are we fighting for? What are we dragging for? Give me kinda chani. Okay, what's keeping us? Why why is the man not here? Huh? Hmm. I thought we sent an misery since morning. Maybe something beyond his control happened. Why have you been laughing? Do you think this matter is funny? And do you think it's your business to ask me why I'm laughing? Let me hear things from you. I will deal with you. Please, let's be guided, please. <laughs> Iko Oku, where is he? He is not here. What do you mean that he's not here? Chikelo is dead. The man we all have been waiting for, so that the DNA test can be run. And you stand there telling us that he's dead. What is that supposed to be? What do you mean by that? The Ojubu. Yes. Chukelia's dead body was found in the bush. According to this story, he was found in the bush two to three days after his death. Hi! What do we do? So we keep waiting on you. Hey! Do you think that we are very close? We are almost close to the plant. Eh? We are close, yes! Who could do this? Eh? Hey! Chikelu. Chikelu. Who did this? Chikelu. How could he just die like that? Just when I, I thought that those rascals would be chased out of this house. Nai. I suspect that someone from this house is responsible for Chikilu's death. Yes. You, you do suspect anyone? Nai, calm down. Cool down your temper. I didn't say anything. You know something? Most definitely, you know something. No, what? Can't you read the handwriting on the wall? It is obvious. Well, I have lost my ophthalmological ability to read. So, tell me, what are you reading on the wall? Joby. Joby is usually so relaxed about all this. He kept laughing at us. Why are you so dumb? Excuse me. You think he did it? I don't think he did it. I know he did it. Yes. Huh? Yes. There is only one person we may need here. And he's going to be an instrument, a very good instrument to us. Dr. Cletus. What about Dr. Cletus? Look at what you're asking me. Why did you fucking tell me that? You know, if this had come from someone else, I swear to God, what I'm going to do to that person, he will not like it. You are talking absolute badness. What? Because you think you killed Chicken Lua, that nobody will understand what you have gone in dealing with your antics. Look, I am going to demystify the mystery behind Chicken Lua's death. And by the time I am through with my artillery, I will do it with nothing than to deal with you squarely. You my girl. Excuse me? Always fast and talking jargon. Are you, are, are, are you sure you're normal? You're educated, but sometimes your reasoning depicts nothing short from someone from the motor park. I will not warn you again. 
This is the last time I can get out of here. Huh? Dobby, you have done the most abominable thing on earth. But there does the revolutionary forces that at the end we shall meet in Philippe. Hey! Dobby have done the most abominable thing on earth. Dobby pissed me. He fucked me. He left me. Just, 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 just dare me again. Just dare me again. But something I had wanted to say uh, was not uh, meant for all oh, years. You know how it is. <laughs> I'm not allowing you to sit on that seat because of you, but because of the respect I have for Chief. If not, I'll take back that respect. What is that supposed to mean? Give me one reason. I'm going to throw you out of my office. Oh! Dead! Dead! Throw me out of this office! This office I built with my money and the equipment and put you here! Try it! And I'll close down this office and make you lose your license and the respect that the chief has for you. Just try it! Are you going? Out of your mind? The same old threat, huh? Oh. Well, I agree. The same old threat. But that same old threat will make you useless for the rest of your life. Because what do you want? <laughs> now you are talking, uh, Dr. Kletos. Well, I have not only told you what I want, but what we want. Kill Chief. This is wickedness. I cannot do that. Dr. Cletus, it is us to tell you whether it is wickedness or not because he is our brother. Besides, Chief's condition is worse than a dead man. So why are you trying to defend a dead man? Why? For your information, Chief left us with a clear instruction. Even if everyone else turns a blind rise, I am obligated to keep it to the very end. Then be ready to dance to the insubordination.
What is it? You don't look happy. Doctor. State of father's health is really making me worried sick. And then what's the use? And then what? You can talk to me, okay? Things are getting worse. What is really the problem? Baby, the doctor said he will be fine, okay? Let's just trust the process. That is not the only problem. So, what else? I have lived all my life loving and calling him daddy. But then all of a sudden, everything proves otherwise. You are your father's son, and so are your siblings. I think I found something. I figured out the solution to this problem. You found what? We have to speak with the doctor first. Okay, fine. L -l Let's do that right away. Mr. Montari, I understand you love to. I would want to do anything to save the situation. But the truth is, this is impossible. Chimera, hell no. Wait, what is really going on? You guys are leaving me out of the conversation. What is Chimera? Don't worry, JB. I mean, it's not for me. I, I, I don't get it. My family is in pandemonium, and, and this looks like the, the, the reason for it. And you're, you're telling me not to be worried. There'll be chimera, is nothing to get worried about. Let alone talk about. It's, it's, it's just a fragment of some medical nonsense. Dr. Clayton, with all due respect, can you tell me what is chimera? What is chimera? Answer the question, doctor. Is it a chimera or chimera? It's chimera. Well, uh, chimera is an imbalanced medical condition. It is very, very rare. In fact, it's impossible. Um, Dr. Cletus, it is rare, yes, but not impossible. Well, um, Ms. Diamond, what do you know about uh, medical conditions? Um, Dr. Cletus. Yes. I will tell you all that you need to know about Chimera and how it can affect the DNA. Because you obviously are so clueless about it. Oh, uh -huh. is that what you think? <laughs> um, for starters, it might interest you to know that I am an American well-trained heart surgeon and a specially trained geneticist. To my uncles and my husband-to-be, permit me to tell you all that you need to know about Chimera and how it can affect the DNA, of course. Excuse me. Are you trying to say that my Older brother, Njamaze, is a tetrachemic uh, human being. Well, I, I hope this is not a hanky panky game between you and, and Diobi, because if it is, uh, I, I, I. Oh, please. Make sure can you keep quiet there. What the? What? 
Can you just calm down? What is it? Case study. Let's not make him baseless at that. Excuse me, I'm not have you insult me. If you do that again, I'm going to take you. What's wrong with you? If I take you, you remember the day you were born. No, 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 I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like the way this no, little no, girl no, 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 is down. talking to me. Calm down, down first. Iko, sit down. down. DOB, you are not the one chairing this occasion or this meeting. Please, my girl, continue. The situation on ground can be referred to as a medical condition known as chimera twin. You can also call it chimerism. Chimeras are animals or humans that contains the cell of two or more individuals. Their bodies contains two different sets of DNA. Chimera twin. Chimera twin occurs when a set of twin has been conceived and the embryo dies in the womb. That's one of the embryo. Now, the surviving fetus absorbs some of the cells of each diseased twin. This gives the surviving fetus two different sets of cells, its own and that of its diseased twin. Excuse me, who else understands this quadratic expression and incoherent incursions? Because I don't understand what this young girl has succeeded in saying. It's absolutely nonsense. No, no, I don't understand. Sit down. What is going to be done now? My friend, shut up there. Shut up there. Illiterate. You think it's about. The simplest explanation to this matter is that Chief might be a chimera twain. And if that is the case, then. What? Exactly what? What next? What stupid thing are you going to say next? If it, I, don't, I don't know. I know that this fabricated story is all to cover Mirabo's infidelity to my brother. Uh, uh, I will not have you insult my mother. Can, can somebody just shut this man up? You can go as long as confusing everybody. I am not to be confused. I have my academic achievements. I am a man of high level. I have my academic film. 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 I very good. This is all I want to hear. Since it can be medically proven, then what are we waiting for? Um, of course we don't have a problem, but I doubt if we can be able to run this test in Nigeria because I don't think Nigeria has the medical sophistication and equipment to carry this test. Are you trying to tell us that it cannot be done in Nigeria? I doubt. Then what do we do? I know few very good hospitals in America where we can run this test. So I would suggest Dr. Cletus and one other member of the family go. I, I, I volunteer because I want to see to the end of this incoherent and incompetent analysis. This is totally a very bombastic and humiliating, and I, I cannot follow it to that halfway. I'm going to follow these people to America, um, if it is um, Switzerland. Uh, what I have to say is, um, please sit down, you're making noise here. Sit. You are sitting here and you watch this little boy. Sit down, down, you're making noise here. Public news. Not like speaking incoherent. Yeah, 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 public news. You don't know anything. It's alright. Alright, to add up to what my girl just said. Babe. You you made your points, okay? But I have just little thing to to ship in, okay? It's about Dr. Cletus going with new people uh, to US. I think that's not really a good idea because 
dad is not feeling fine. So he needs someone to at least stay with him and examine him time to time. Okay, so I suggest um, you and other member of the family, anyone that wants to go can go with you, but not this man. This madman is not going anywhere. You don't have to go anywhere with them. Well, I, I think D.O.B. has a point there. And I quite think so. And so, in that case, I'll have to join the Coco one day. Yes. Very well. That is well. I agree. of me wears me down. It is heavier than I can bear. It cannot be compared to that which you have brought upon people. So shall you carry it till you get to your destination. My strength may fail me. I may not get to my destination. You don't deserve anything less. I have another news for you. When you get to your destination, the rest that you seek, you cannot get. You will continue reaping that which you have sown in the life of people. Now be going before I made this heavier for you. What is it? I, I, I had a dream. What, what dream? Nay, please. Please, I'm begging you. I, 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 I wouldn't want you to take that journey you want to make with Dilby's girlfriend and your brother. Please, don't, don't go. Well, Alice, it's okay. What, what, what? Just tell me, is, is that what the dream was all about? No, Nai, no, but please, I, I don't want you to join them. Now listen to please. me. Did you see me in the dream that I died on the process of joining them on the trip? Okay. If the answer is yes, then go back to your dream and tell those people that showed you the dream that they gave you a wrong visual aid, right? Because nothing that is living or dead is going to stop me. No. No. Why, can't why you... are you asking me why? Oh, do you think that uh, I'm uh, 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 the first person that indicated interest on this trip? Listen, listen. Everything that that has to do with this means the whole world for me, and I will stop at nothing to get to the end of this. Bon voyage. No, no. Why can't you just listen to me for once? Why can't you? What are we fighting for? What are we dragging for? Give me kind of journey. Give me kind of sunny moon. What are we fighting for? What are we dragging for? Give me kind of journey. Give me kind of 
Dr. Clay, you said that father is dead. Wait, who is dead? No, 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 what did, I, 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 you, what say? did you say? He said he's coming to address us. Address what? What happened? I need to see my husband. Excuse me. I don't know what he's talking about. What? What? I don't know what he's talking about. Father is dead. What kind of... Excuse me. No. Dr. Cletus. Please, can you make me to understand why you don't want us to see our brother's corpse even days after he's dead? Is there anything fishing that you want us to understand? Please tell me what is going on, my dear. I'm surprised. Even if you or anyone would want to agree anything, you all know that Chief's body is right here in his house. Therefore, there's nothing absolutely going on. Like Chief said, uh, Ikoku, his younger brother, will be put in charge of his possessions in case he dies. So just like he said, that still stands. You know, um, it, I think it's the responsibility of the family lawyer to put him in charge of the uh, company, to oversee the day-to-day -day activities of the company if he comes back from his trip to America. With all due respect, We seem to be forgetting something in all this conversation. Which is? Diamond opened our eyes to a medical condition, which could be the reason my children's DNA did not match with my husband's own. What if it's proven to be what she said? What will be my own children's uh, fate if we go on with the former plan? It's not only a former plan. It is what your husband said. That's exactly what is going to happen. But we are... Oh, what? Do you wait? No. Well, well, that's all right. Um, I'd like to... I would also like to chip in here the term. It's, it's imperative the, the family proceed with the necessary burial rights as soon as the autopsy you know, is completed. Are you trying to tell me that we cannot see our brother's corpse until the autopsy result is out? Uh, I'm sorry about that, Chair, but that might be the case. You did not allow us to see him while he was alive. Now that he's dead, you still want to do the same. Why? What's going on? Tell me the truth. Well, Chair, I'm doing the best for this family. If Chief were to be here, he would say nothing short of this. Doctor, let me be honest with you. 
this thing you said doesn't go down with me. But I will give it the benefit of that. I have told you, everything you are doing there is useless. Yes. Yeah. Now, what we have been waiting for has happened. And you need to come back and take what rightfully belongs to you. You see, the problem I have with you is that you don't listen to me. Eh? When you wanted to embark on that journey, I told you not to go. You ignored me. Now I am calling you to come back and take what rightfully belongs to you. You are trying to ignore me again. What is even your problem? Eh? What is your problem, this man? Father is dead. So what's the use? You need to come back. What? Wait, what did you just say now? The Chimera test came out positive. Wait, wait, I don't understand. Does this mean that Father is a Chimera twin? Diamond said the results proved so. When did she tell you this? Earlier today. So this means that Father is still our father. That's exactly what it means. But of what use, God said. Of what use when Father is no longer here. It's like... To see it. It's like losing her to win. Of what use. It's okay. He died not knowing the truth. He died thinking mom disappointed him. He died with betrayal in his mind thinking that mom betrayed him. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Of what use? Nay, something has been bothering me lately. What is it? What should be bothering you at this moment? Hmm. Well, let me inform you. The moment we all have been waiting for is almost at hand. So you should remain focused and let us achieve what we want to do. You don't seem to understand, man. Make me to understand. I've been seeing Chikelue in my dreams. Chikelue? What kind of dreams do you have about him? A bad one. A very bad dream. The other day, he gave me a heavy burden to carry. And he always haunts me all the time in my dreams. Ignore it. Ignore it? Yes. No, it's not possible. Yes. It's not possible. Did I tell you that he cursed me in my dream? Eh? Hmm. So, that's the more reason you should ignore him. How can a dead person cause you? The living and the dead, which is more powerful? Nah. Hmm? My dear, why not listen? You should be happy and make merry. Because very soon, your husband will be made the new CEO of my brother's companies. So forget about all this dream that does not make sense. Eh? Makes no sense. Rejoice, be happy. Yes. 
Are you really sure about this arrangement? I mean, why should we keep it a secret? Just do as I say. I have my plans on ground, okay? Meanwhile, whoever cares to know what transpired in America, tell him or her the results were all negative. Dobi and his siblings are not Chief Njamanze's children. Just exactly what you told the Koku and his brother in America. Okay? Dr. Cletus, this doesn't sit well with me. It doesn't. One bit, it doesn't. It doesn't sit well with me. I'm in charge, okay? I'm in charge. But why does Dr. Cletus want this? Does he not know that this will delay everything else and it will eventually blow up on our faces? Um, well, Dr. Cletus is... He's always articulate, extremely articulate. I trust he has a strong reason for this. So, Mom, in essence, you're saying you trust him completely? Yes, I do. Mom. I trust him. If you ask me, I will, I will suggest we go straight to the point we we'll hit the nail on the head. There's no point going all around when we know the truth. This is going to be very, very hard. Very, very tight. He's just Okay, so what's the next step? We have to wait for you. The next step is simple. Exactly what I told you. And what is that? Because I don't remember. What? Oh, yes. Nayoji. Mm -hmm. I am sorry to bring your attention back to the question you have already asked. We all know what the tradition of this land says in a situation like this. Mirabel here and her bastard children should have been out of this house before now. As you all know, neither this unfaithful woman here nor any of her bastard children must see Chief's face in death. According to the tradition, it is considered a taboo. Alice, just like I told my brothers seated here, Ikoku and Dike, when we were discussing this matter earlier on, we all know the custom and tradition. And we have a king who equally understood our custom and tradition. He is the custodian of our tradition. He knows everything that is happening in this family. He asks us to let them be. Let them be? Why would he say they should be? For what? Why? This matter would be the way he wants it to be. But one thing I guarantee you, he will not allow them to stay in this house until his funeral. Oh, wow. Okay. Nine. This one you invited me to come over as soon as I can. I hope all is well. I am worried. But you said I shouldn't bother about anything again. That the moment we all have been waiting for is here. Eh? That nothing should bother me. Was that not what you told me? I said so. But it's Chikelo. He has been tormenting me in my dreams in the night. Chikelo, Not only that, he attacks me in the night. Chikelo. Yes, Chikelo. Nai. Yes. It's time we put him right where he belongs. You said he was not going to be a problem. Yes, I did. But I was saying that with the understanding that we are going to. And we never did. To the best of my knowledge. I didn't. Did you? Of course I didn't. 
It was no longer necessary. Uh, yes. I just hope you are telling me the truth. I'm telling you the truth. Huh. Hey. I said, go, 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 go back. Hmm. What's the I said you people have no right over this house again. Yes. You should be more grateful to Igwe because he asked me to allow all of you to stay here uh -huh. and, and for some time. But don't be smiling yet. I will make this house and this place fugacious for all of you. So use the best one. Uh, you will use the best one. My own father's house. My own father's house. <laughs> Ever since Uncle Ikoku was reinstated as the MD of the companies, We've been living like slaves. That's exactly who you are. All of you are slaves. It's self explanatory. No, 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 no they, they are slaves. Holy DJ, let him finish. Please go on. You must allow him to finish. Take over with him. My son, please go on. All I'm saying yes. is that he unfreezes my account and returns my car keys. How could he confiscate everything, including the ones I bought with my money? So please, help me talk to him to behave himself. Are you aware that today he locked, he locked us out from entering our father's house? For what reason? You know, I was telling you on the phone, you didn't understand that part. He locked us out from entering our father's house. D.O.B., you've made your point. There's no need for you to attack him. That is, that's exactly what they do. They attack me every now and then. The other year of his brother nearly pulled my waist out of my body. But, but it's not because I'm strong. But this boy and his brother are the closer pain in the ass. But that's not the problem. We are talking about what he's saying about money. Ask this boy where has he ever worked for in his life? Which office, which conglomerate, which establishment has this boy worked for? And he's talking about money. Which money is he talking about? Hey, say, what what I, I, say what eh? you know. Which you are where? Which boy? This boy had not worked for anything in his life. Did my father get me a job in Amazon? I did that myself. If you must know. What is Amazon? No, no, I'm asking you, what is Amazon? Amazon is something that exists in the air. There's no office. Ask him which office is, is Amazon located. Is it number four or number five? Amazon is something that you cannot see. My it's friend, in the air. I don't know it. No, it's great. Which address? Ego. Number four, Ego. number five. My father isn't buried yet. And, and, and you're already Please, head over heels about, about his property. I, I will not I, sit here sure? and watch this boy. I will not sit down here and watch handle this boy. He's me your presence. Sorry, it's okay. Sit down. Sit down, Ikoku. Sit down. 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 Does you never ask you, you know me. Let me finish my Uncle, dear. just talk, just talk. I'm already angry. Is, what, is, what is wrong with this easy. man? Easy! Seeing that it's subordination from this point. If you are in a hurry, you will pass where you are going before you start coming back. It's okay, talk. Easy. Ikoku, we never ask you to go and take anything that belongs to Mirabel. Mm. So or any of our children. What are we talking about? No, what are we talking about? We are talking about the issues on the ground. How to take over, how to make sure that my brother's property is in, in a good hand. And not to those strangers. And you're telling me that, that I'm not supposed to, 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 to have gone there. Take over what? Did you work for it? Charge of my brother Did you work for it? Because my brother is, is dead. Oh my god. I have to take over what belongs to my brother. Go, 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 go. Allow me to land. Let me make it clear to you. You see his khaki, you will return it to him. That a cat that you froze, you must defrost it right now with immediate effect. I will not do that. Have, have you seen it? No, 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 I want to did ask I, you. Did I tell you that what? the other day he no, locked no, us out me. from entering our house? Whoa, 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 whoa. Which, which side are you? He locked us out from entering no, my father's no, house. Shut up! Stop talking when I'm talking. Which side are you? Are you? Not tell me! 
You have been meandering over this issue for so much length. Like one minute you are with me, the other minute you are with Mirabel and her children. No, tell me, it is when you tell me who you are that I begin to understand where you are coming from. No, at what point have you become a dinosaur or a chameleon? Be at a place, let me know who you are. No, it is when you are at a place that I will understand where you are coming from. No, you could, I just Locked want to... Lock me from entering my father's house. Shut up! I said, I allow you to handle it. No! I will not do that! I will break the way you spoil it! I will break the way you spoil it! You see, Dr. Pilatus, things are getting worse by the day. We need to reveal the truth about this whole thing. You don't want things to get so bad to the point of no reverse. We need to tell them the truth about this DNA thing. They should be able to know. For instance, if we had told them the truth, Ikuko wouldn't have been made the, the CEO. Well, uh, Dr. Diamond, I, I know how you feel about the whole thing. But trust me, nothing, absolutely nothing has changed. Everything is still 100% under control. Everything is not under control. That selfish man is in church. Diamond, Ikuku is not in charge. He's in charge of nothing. It's just a ceremonial head. Chief Idamanje is still in charge. Chief? Yes. Chief is dead. Chief is not dead. long ago but you never listen you never listen to me i told you to send these people out of this house no 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 one listen you see why are you talking like this have you forgotten the part that said that igwe instructed that they should stay here until the burial is over what is even the igwe's problem why can't he take his hands off another man's matter what is this problem Obasalia? Alice, you just talk like an idiot. Have you forgotten how close Njamaze was with the Igwe when he was still here? And that nonsense closeness should be brought to an end. By the way, my husband, what is even holding your brother's barrier? And what sort of autopsy is the hospital still doing with his body for weeks now that he can neither be seen or buried? I think you and your brother are being lenient to this stupid doctor man. Yes, you are. Exactly what you people are doing. We will not allow this week to pass without you revealing the body of Chief Njemans to us, his family members, so that we can have it prepared for burial. Oh, good. Ojuku, good. But let us not preempt this issue. This man seated here is an organ scavenger. Ikoku, oh yes. My brothers and I have seen enough of him. Personally, I do not like these mediocratic infested doctors. Brothers, let me be more sincere to you. This man seated here is an organ scavenger. He has, you know, harvested some vital parts of Njamanze, our brother, and probably stitching the wounds back and waiting to bring his caravan back to I us. Not, look, I will not have you here to insult me, get me insulted. I've had enough of your insolence here. How can you open your guilty stinking Bugu cavity to call me names? Have you forgotten who I am, a medical doctor, a professional? And you share on that tab blatant disregard dis dis for my personality? You're calling me names here. Look at this figurative idiot. A bonnet tact figurative idiot. Societal and personal non character like you. Calling me names. Look, if in the end, what you've just uttered out is proven to be wrong, I'm going to get you arrested and charge you for character defamation. This is you that I am going to deal with, having been defamed with this Yakwachi medical practice. Look at you. We are only waiting for tsunami to be rubbed up, then we will see the real bed, bed of the sea. Look at this man, a scarecrow, a world of chance, the scariest species. Enough, enough, seven. everybody, enough. Doctor, 
I'm, am, listening, I'm listening. I'm listening. I'm giving you two days within which you must finish with that autopsy. Thereafter, we will want to see the result and also have his body for burial. Final. We are giving him one day. One day. No. One, one day is enough. Keep quiet. Quiet, man. So why why didn't you want to come to the hospital? I don't think your office was going to be the right place for this conversation. Really? So, um, what's the content of the conversation? You have to start by telling me what you meant when you said Chief isn't dead. There's nothing more to say about that. It's just what it is. Chief is not dead. No, Chief is not dead. So, where has he been all this while? He's been in his house. Though last night I, I secretly moved him out of his house. How were you able to come up with... With all these plans, eh? Is that what you want to know? You know, Chief is a very smart and proactive person. In fact, one of the smartest I've ever seen in my life. Let's just say he foresaw what will happen to his empire. If it's not there. He knows the shroud uh, uh, and the egoistic, self-centered uh, Ikoku, his younger brother, very well. So when the DNA thing happened, Chief decided to use it as an opportunity to execute his grand plan on Ikoku and uh, his wicked wife, Alice. I don't understand. What grand plan are you talking about? Soon, Ikoku's plans will come to an end. The family has given me an ultimatum. So, what are you going to do now? Isn't that going to alter your plans with Chief? Never. In fact, it just got it expedited. I don't get it. Okay, let's just say they shot themselves in the foot when they gave me the ultimatum. I still don't understand. The ultimatum says two days from today, the family want to see the body of Chief Njamanze. Mm -hmm. And Chief, they will surely see. But you know what the good news is? They are not going to see the body of Chief. They will see Chief in person. <laughs> A lie. This is absolutely nonsense. We were told that Chief is lying in state inside this palace. That's true. What happened? What is this? Why is he inside this ambulance? Listen, 
You cannot fool me. When the doctor Jesus take my brother to the mortuary, I am the, I'm not that fool. In the constitution of this country, Dr. Cletus is a foreigner. In the constitution of this country, Dr. Cletus is a foreigner. No, I, 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 you cannot fool me. That is the liar. That is the liar. That doctor is here. Yes. Where is that doctor? Where is the doctor? He is a criminal. And I will have him arrested. Doctor Gletus, not to succeed in my father's compound. You will die by force. You will die by fire. Oh, have you had you have fired another? This man's supposed to be in dungeon cooling off there. He's supposed to be arrested. Yes, he must be arrested. Ikoku. He is actually not the one to be arrested. You will be arrested. Eh? You. But don't worry. When the time comes, what about the DNA results? Diamond? He didn't tell them? That in Wisconsin Hospital, I was given a, a, a pure... Two result. different results. Excuse me? What's that supposed to mean? Yes. The hospital issued us two different results. I made them do so. Jamazi, this is the first class lie in my, in my time. It is not possible. It is not possible. The result confirms that Chief is a Chimera twin. He doesn't only possess his DNA, but that of his brother, which he absorbed while still a fetus. Which by extension further explains the complication behind the different match between his DNA and that of his children. You are the little, you are the class, so yes, Chief is a camera to us. We get angry the people everywhere. Self-centered people everywhere. They love luxurious life without suffering. 
They love lavish things without you thinking. Good afternoon, sir. My name is Chigose. I stay two villages away from the community where Mazi Chikole lives. I was walking in the bush while I saw Mazi Chikole, while I saw the late Mazi Chikole walk into the, that bush. I could send this his unusual look of uncertainty, which I hit to watch what he was up to. I saw that he kept waiting and I decided not to go. After this woman walked into that same bush. Which, which woman? Me? How? Shut up, first. He's still talking. Uh, Look at this little boy accusing me. Are you mad? Now yourself. let him talk. Let him uh, talk what? What, 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 what are you saying? Do you know me? Oh, oh, no, no, no. Uh, don't tell my wife to, to keep quiet. Uh, how can you, how can you allow quiet? this straight boy to, to, to be accusing my wife and you all keep quiet oh, and watch everything yes. finish talking? Alice, ah, shut up your mouth. Shut up your mouth. Uh, Chigose, go on. Thank you, sir. After a while, she walked into that bush. I saw that there was an argument between the both of them. After she has handed an envelope which he seems to be unsatisfied with. After Mazichikolu was going home, this woman pulled out a knife and stabbed him at the back. Uh, what, 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 what did you say? I did what? What did you say? Me? I stabbed Chikolu. Do you know me before? Shut up! How can you accuse me? Excuse me. How much is the pay? Who are you? No, 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 no! Wait, wait! I don't want to 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 I do you have to be it. Looking at you, you are a hungry boy. And they're going to change it. Shh. Let me see your evidence then. What the Hey! Hey! hey. Jesus. Ah. Hey. Jesus hey. Christ. Hey. Jesus. What is it? Alice. Alice, let us see. Let us see. Alice, let us see. Alice, see. see it. You didn't hold this. See it. Uh, don't don't, don't, don't call my name. Don't call my name because you are not better than I am. Oh, you think I will forget in a hurry? You think I can forget in a hurry? You lie. What are you talking about? Jesus Christ. Been. I've been calling your number, it's not connected. I went out. Jemanze was here. Oh, as always. Please, it should go and rest. Oh. Alice. Uh huh. This guy has been giving you green light. And you're busy fornicating with other men. You better do something before he changes his mind. And it will be too late for you. Oh, my word. Jemanze? Change his mind? How? He doesn't even have a mind of his own. Come on, baby. I have him right here. At the palm of my hands. So get off it. Alice. Yeah? Alice. Yes. Alice. Yes. You Mirada. better stop this, your bad attitude, before it comes too late for you. Don't only think you have every man that comes your way on your palms. Don't I? I always do. No, you don't. I always do. Of course you don't. This was how you lost Charles. Charles? Yes. You're comparing that one? He's an asshole, you should know. Oh! What about that boy? That Yoruba demon. Eh? That Yoruba demon. He's not even my type. I, I thought you know me better. Really? Yes. Obinanko. Hmm. You are dead. Obina cheated on me and you know it. Moreover, why are you trying to remind me of the atrocities those idiots committed in my life? Alice, I am not trying to remind you of any atrocities. But I am telling you to change. Change before it becomes too late for you. You don't even do well enough to, to, to have a man. Ha ha ha! Just said another one. Oh! I, Alice! No, you don't. Doesn't know how to keep a man. You don't. Oh, miss, keeping a man. Why haven't you gotten a man for yourself? 
You should look at yourself before you talk to me. Excuse me. And where is that coming from? You better tell me who provoked you because I am not the person. You have to take me back. Trust me, Jamazi. If there's anything to say, I won't hesitate to tell you. Mirabe, you know the truth. You know the truth. Alice is frolicking with other men. That is why she don't have my time. Where are you getting all this from? Who has been feeding you with all these lies? You know exactly what I'm talking about. She's everywhere with men. She doesn't stay at home. Okay, fine. Is she at home now? Where is she? I already told you she went to get... Can you stop making excuses for her? I don't like it. I don't. Why can't she just be like you? Why? Jamanza. You need to calm down. Stop telling me that. No, please. but you really need to calm down. You're taking this too far and you're believing people, outsiders. You don't need to believe them. You need to believe whatever she tells you. You just need to calm down. She will soon be home, okay? You are the lady. You are the Colossia. I'm out of bed. You're dead. You're not drunk. You are the lady. You are the Colossia. I'm out of bed. You're dead. You're not drunk. You are the lady. You are the Colossia. I'm out of bed. You're dead. You're not drunk. You are the lady, you are the Colossia. I'm out of bed, you dead, can you leave your night on Kenobu? Onyanyuku, Mvinese, Bugogi. Wicked and greedy people, everywhere. Self-centered people, everywhere. They love luxurious life without suffering. They love lavish things. Who was that guy? My friend, all the time, I will be chicken. My friend. And he was holding you yes, in that manner. Yes, yes. Yes. Baby, how will you? Come on. Alice, yeah? what exactly is your problem? No, Mirabel. I should be asking you that question. What exactly is your problem? Why are you always on my case in this house? Why can't you just let me take water in my house and drop cup for goodness sake? What is your problem, Alice? I don't have a problem. Okay? I don't have a problem, but the problem I have is to, with you is that you don't stay at home whenever this guy comes in. Anyways, Jemanze was here. And so? Mirabel, and so? What do you mean by and so? Oh. This guy is always here and he doesn't meet you at home. Is that you're in your boyfriend's house or on your way to meet a sugar daddy? Alice, I am tired of making excuses for you. Oh, yes. I is that the reason? You should question me in my own house. You know what? I think you should go to him and tell him I said he should go to hell and burn to ashes for all I care. Do you hear me? And I think your stay in this house is over. You know what I mean, Robert? Your stay in this house is over. I'm done. It has no I said I'm this. done. Why is all the question? Why would you question in my own house? Go in there, pack your things, and leave my house immediately. And Alice. you know what? I will help you do that. Why didn't you tell me your friend had another boyfriend? I don't understand what you're talking about. What is it you don't understand? I just caught her messing up with another guy. I believe you don't know that I'm no longer staying with Mirabel. Yes, I'm no longer staying with her. She asked me to leave her house. 
So I don't really know things going on with her now. Why? Because I have been defending you. So she asked me to leave. You said you weren't eating, no, we bought it. So take that. You <laughs> barely. Well, it's fine. Yes, that's not your friend. Mm -hmm. But do you know he's more fine in pictures than real? Because he looks like chimpanzee. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yes, come in. What is she doing here? Okay, just calm down. Just calm down. You're not answering my question. What is she doing here? She threw me out of her house. Knowing fully well that I had nowhere to go to. Wait a minute. How did you get to my house? See. Who brought you here? Babe. Rest in. I. I told her about it. Just to last. You've not answered my question. What are you doing in my house, Alice? Uh, see. <sighs> I I told her about us. You see? She's very sorry about what she did to you. Besides, she came to my house the other day. She apologized before my father and my brothers. So, I forgive her. I think you two should do the same. You know what she did to me, right? I know. Just... You're begging. Just look at yourself. You're begging. The same way I begged the day you threw me out. Did you see how it is now? Yeah. Please just forgive her. Please. For my sake. Please. Mm. Oh my god, I'm so hot, baby. Mm. I know you missed me. I love baby. With <laughs> your crazy attitude. <laughs> I hope you're changing. I'm a love. There is something at least I'm not going to talk about. More surprise? <laughs> yes, more surprises. <laughs> So who is telling me about the surprise? You or you? Okay. I think he was want to be should. Babe, start talking. I I think my brother is in love with her. I mean, for some time now both have been going out. No? Which of your brother? And how come I'm just getting to know about this now? And mother. Which of them? Ikoko. And I'm just getting to know about it now. Really? But you know how things things are between you guys before. So, for how long has this been going on? <laughs> well, um, going to four months now. Four months? Babe. Huh? You didn't even mention this to me. Alas, I, I just want to make it a surprise. Come oh, on, I'm happy for you too. Oh, I was expecting that. Oh. Finally. Yeah, I'm sorry, I don't know this. I don't like this. No more secrets. No more secrets. Ah, I see. So you thought I was very happy that you took away the only man I ever loved? You think I was happy? At least, what never. are you talking about? You never loved Chief. You were busy jumping from one man to another. Mm. How many of them do you have? How many? Um, I see. Honey, no wonder. I knew all along that she was going around, sleeping around with men. And you were there covering her up. I was just trying to... But this is protect not the matter at hand. We are talking about this murderer. You're, 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 you're talking about what happened. So this is huh? why you hate us so much, right? Huh? 
protect So this is what you do? This is why you hate us? Oh my god. You're going to pay for your Okay, okay, very good, very good. They are here. They are here. Ikoku here is a scammer. His wife, Alice, is an unrepentant woman. Both of them have been plotting, setting their eyes on my assets, wanted to kill me, to take over my empire. But uh, you've seen it. You've seen it. <sighs> <laughs> do not call me. Don't call me. Okay. I said, do not call me. Okay. Now, in the video of doing that, oh. your wife has shed an innocent blood. Go back there. Come, come, you're welcome. Go back there. Do not call me. You know you're my brother. This is a family matter. This is for the police. I'm not a bad you're not 